Hello. Good time zone, everybody. Hello, hello. Welcome to... Maybe we're finishing Cyberpunk today, but also maybe not. I don't know. Maybe tomorrow, who knows? Nice and vague, it's what you get. Hi, Elvaniel. Oh no. Oh no. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. I'm a kitty cat. Azure! Welcome back. Thank you so much for the race of. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. So funny that you did the suspicious one right as I was uh, about to say hello to suspicious fish. Stumbled on every single word there. Hi, Linny. Hi, Tindal. Hello, hello, hello. Hi, Loneliest. Hi, Shadow. Playing again myself and taking my mom to lunch later. Oh, I hope you have a good lunch. That sounds cozy. I'm really good at talking usually. Just not here. Not here right now. <laughs> Hi, Landar. Balance! Thank you so much for subscribing with Prime! Welcome in! Thank you very much! That's very kind of you! Hello, hello! Oh, now you didn't get a cool alert! That sounds, uh, that sounds unreasonable, actually. Welcome in! Thank you so much! Enjoy your emotes, I hope! You're gonna punk all over this place! Branson, maybe? Maybe we might! <laughs> no promises! Hi, Skate! Hello! I'm on time for a change. Say or listen. You're always on time. You arrive precisely when you mean to. Hi, you girls. Hi, Ronnie. Is this a soup shop? It can be, if you want it to be. Hi, Wall. Hello, hello. Hi, Jean-Paul. See, I figured it was you, but I didn't want to assume this time. <laughs> Sometimes people steal your redeem. Ah, they clan are. It was me that did the sus thing. You never know. You never know. Hi, season. <laughs> Hello. My name is supposed to be a bit hard to say. Part of why I picked it. Ah, suspicious. Vis. I'm just gonna call you Vis in Dutch. How about that? Apparently, the Fortnite people. Was it the Fortnite people? No, maybe it was the Genshin people. They were the best guy around, and also the people they murdered. Apparently they hired the person who did the, the little toothless dance and uh, added them for an April Fool's joke. I might be wrong. Exiashia, welcome back. Thank you so much for the resub. Bonjour. <laughs> hello, hello. I've been hiding for cyberpunk spoilers because I still haven't played the DLC. Have you played the main story? Because we did the DLC. There is one DLC quest I'm ending right now because yesterday I went ahead and I decided to get all of the quick travel points just in case there was something there that I missed there was one quest I found that I had not done yet and I also got an, uh, a phone call from somebody who was the LC quest so I will t uh, that's what I'm starting with so I'll tell you when I when I jump into that and then maybe if you don't want to see that it is a side quest but still um, it'll be like 10 minutes probably I'll actually play the game <laughs> It's easy to trip on. It is a little bit. I remind everyone, would why would Jinzi complete the game when we could have another Just Chatting stream? But we're not going to do that today. I want to finish the game. Either today or tomorrow. Head empty, butt wiggling. <laughs> Vulcan. Otter! Do you like my outfits? Do you like my style? I think she looks incredible. You're co copying Noob now? No, I'm not. <laughs> what? I finished the main game? Okay, okay. Duck, hello. Hello, hello. Have a good lurk, V. She does not have- she does have the knife. I have multiple knives, in fact. I have a collection. <laughs> Although they are mostly in my apartment, save for, save for one. I also changed my cyberware. Why is your torso a different color? It's because it's mesh. I, would, I don't think you can really see that very well. Um, but it's mesh. The top has mesh over it. You can have them in different colors as well, but this one is uh, black mesh. Is saying my name terribly wrong? The most terribly even. He says Exatia. I definitely did not say Exatia. <laughs> that is simply not correct. Listen, you have a really difficult name, actually, okay? 
It's it's only actually pronounceable for the people of the void, of which I am not one. Sushi. <laughs> yes. So this is my cyberware now. As you can see, I've almost fully maxed out my edge runner. I had I had to fight to get the quantum tuner in there, but this thing is great. I just get to berserk twice in a row, which is fantastic. I also changed out the Kerensikov, I think it's called, because I did not use it. It was not used by me. And instead I got like this for when you get noticed, like time slows when you get noticed, which is great. And uh, this one is uh, it's just nice. <laughs> and uh, this one also, no wait, this one also with more crit chance for my blades and throwable weapons. Did something break? I don't know. I can do it twice in a row and then I have to wait a little bit. Cause this one has a this one has a cooldown of 35 seconds. This one resets it immediately. If I want another one, I have to kill a few people. I thought you wanted an X. I thought you wanted people to pronounce the X. Did you not want to pronounce the X as an X? Did you want it X? Because I swear you told me you wanted X. So it's intentional cyberware. Okay, listen, listen. I'm gonna start calling you Mr. X at this point. I'm just gonna call you Mr. X. See, we're essentially a cyber psycho. We are crazy a lot during combat, yes. We cackle when we kill somebody. If we do it, if we do it um, in the right, correct way. I don't know what the right, correct way is, but I have a really high chance now. I have a four point. Well, a four point one chance is if it's really high. Actually, it is. I also have a good amount of armor, so you know. Was it because X can't give it to you? Maybe. I didn't ask him. It's the third time I've heard a, a discussion about X's name. Yeah, it's because he has a really difficult name with a very specific pronunciation that does not work for my, my tongue. And I've tried. Oh my God, did I try? Okay, listen. X is how, that's how X is pronounced for me. In both English and Dutch, X or X is how you pronounce it. That's why it is difficult for my brain. Just a different berserk than what I'm used to, but just imagine three berserks in a row. But this one, okay, so there's a there's a there's one that has 40. It requires 40 cyberware to equip. That one's not that good, I don't think. Because that one doesn't have the 100 percent crit damage, but instead you are immune to damage. I don't really see the point of that one though. It's really expensive to equip. I may be more confused each time. I think that's the point. <laughs> Cthulhu can probably pronounce it. It's true. I should hire Cthulhu to sit next to me and do it for me. Every single time. Marcus, hello. Good time zone. I thought X and X sounded the same. They do. Unless you don't, unless you do it in a sentence, then it's X instead. X is pronounced Twitter, actually. That's true. That's true. That is what happens. It's one of those puzzles of Yogg-Saron. He really just, he did, he did the, the best possible name for somebody uh, who, uh, what's the word for this? Communes with the outer ones. The quantum tuner is great, but there's also some cool stuff only attainable by the other Phantom Liberty ending paths. Better than this? No. We don't have to sit here and give the French respect like that. The very idea. Do you not like the French? <laughs> but then also with an X. Did you know Lovecraft was racist, Otter? Otter, but what about his letters, Otter? Otter! His letters! <laughs> Hi, Kaiju. Hello. What about his emails? <laughs> You did it for two weeks even, but then I got different drugs and now I can't do it anymore. Listen, I'm doing my best, okay? No one is doing their best more on your name on the entirety of Twitch than I am. Is that for non-blondes or Usher? 
that's four non four non blondes, obviously. It has to be. Cause Usher is in that set. Yay, yeah, yay. Okay, it could be, I guess. But that would we don't do that one. We don't do that one. So you're playing Chrono Trigger again? Enjoy. Hi Velico. Hello. Hello, hello. He's such a nice cat. <laughs> Listen, I'm trying. Next time. We do a reset again next time. Okay. Azure, don't look for 10 minutes or so. 10 or so minutes. I'm going to quickly do the DLC bit. You, I, you, okay. Uh, are you, okay. Okay. Because the lady, the blonde lady is here again. Uh, somewhere anyway. See the blue container? I'm waiting inside. You see how suspicious this is? Oh, there's loot next to her. That's a hostile area. Oh. Ah! Uh, yep. You <laughs> it's so fun that she sold me out again. No, no, no. Isn't it so fun that she sold me out again? Are we, aren't we all so surprised? I am personally incredibly surprised. Me? I did not see it coming. I thought for sure she was kind and loving and uh, a good person. There's the cackle. Max Engineer! Did she thought that, think that was gonna kill me? Congratulations, uh, you played yourself. Like what she said, I'm waiting over here. Like, okay, I'll be honest. When, when I got her message the first time, I was like, okay, you're gonna fuck with me. And then, and then the container, I'm waiting in the container. Come on, <laughs> come on now. Putting together a crew for a little corpo gig. Gonna make some chick disappear. No witnesses, no questions. If it's a little gig, why do you need a whole crew? I said no questions, you in or not? Depends. On what? For which corporates? BT? Okay, sounds good, but I don't wor merc work for Militech. Conscientious objection. Not, not the lies. Not the lies. Oh, she's also, okay. No, I do have, I do have messages. She doesn't want to say anything else? Are you sure? Are you sure? She better text me again afterwards. She better, because I am incredibly not dead. Unless they got to her, but I doubt that. Okay. Well, that was her whole quest, I guess. The other one I found was this one it is a bunch of people that are murdered on a set and i didn't look into anything else because johnny was like whoa and i was like oh that looks like a quest goodbye <laughs> then i left immediately good lurks have a good lurk i don't work for Militech. i have a conscience that's why i only work for arasaka and they are much nicer they are much better people obviously this was by Technica screwing you over, not your clients. Duh, you don't know that. You don't know that. She could have just sold out. She could have just sold out. But I think they killed her. I'm gonna. She, she does not seem that smart. So they probably killed her. And then took her phone. The bastards. It's a good thing I kill everyone Biotechnica related every single time. Otherwise, that would be upsetting. See, I got this. I got this fast travel point, and then uh, the, uh, this. Uh, this. That's what I found. And I don't even know if it's a particularly interesting quest, but it's a quest, and I'm not gonna deprive you of a quest. Wow, legs for years. Search the set. What am I searching for? Ah, new rural beauty. Aha. Uh -huh. Inspire the city. Enjoy the country. What if I do neither? Yeah, exactly. 
Get in the car, Shinji. That's the whole job. That was the whole job. It was taking this car. Okay. Well, you know what? At least you saw me do it. <laughs> I can't be upset. <laughs> what a great job. Hello there, Mr. Stark. <laughs> now we're going to do this one. I also bought all of the apartments. I could hang out with Judy, but I'm not going to. All right, and I got another one of these points. I bought one, but I don't really know where I want to put it, if anywhere. We can just, um, we can do, um, we can uh, just, uh, sure. You know? Yeah, exactly. Were you on any drugs when I got there? I don't think so. I rewatched all four Evangelion movies in one go. Are you okay? First free car I found in the game. Oh, my first light. That was the first one you found. And then it was the last one I found. Incredible. Such dichotomy. <laughs> Hi, Jeff. Can't imagine watching all four in a row sober. It was over eight hours. And so, so you're not okay. So you need a little now. I think it's time. All right, kids. Hi, it's me. I'm going to make a save here. Obviously. Even though I already have another one. And another one. And another one. Hi. They're expecting me. I'm sure this can only go well. As my relic immediately malfunctions. God, I feel sick. Same. Don't like this at all. Oh. I this made tea water and then never made the my tea. Kind of news. Good job, Gen Z. I know. I'll be careful. Yeah, I'll trust you. Not idea. exactly one of your Listen, strongs. am I still alive or am Listen, I still alive? Sign of trouble, he dealt her. I'm so incredibly in one piece, Johnny. Oh, uh, that's the that's incredibly the white suit. Hi, Ernesto. Hello. Almost done with the community center in Stardew. There's only bits from the bulletin board left. I love doing the. Community she center. The place. Shit. It's so satisfying. Love your piano play. Excellent. You have come. Yes, and I have a, a several berserks at my disposal. Let's step to it then. Before we discuss details, I feel I owe you an explanation. I must tell you why I changed my mind. I love her gold nails, fingers, you whatever. sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your Nobud killed your father, no? I knew. From the start. You knew? All the board members knew. I knew they Not would know. Not one soul even slightly interested in the matter believed <laughs> in the poisoning. Details were disparate, inconsistent. See, I kind of figured that they would already know, not because of the details or whatever that she's saying now, but because of uh, the note we found. It was either a note or somebody said it that she, the sister, has had to already convince the dad before to not kick uh, Yorinobu out of the family, to not just absolutely end this man because she felt bad for him. Like, obviously, if he's the only person in the room when the dad dies, there's a few alarm bells ringing. Okay. You knew, but didn't do a thing about it? Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? Okay, V, it has been maybe a year in game time. Give her a break. My father had flaws. I know this. I harbor no illusions about it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? Power? The corp? I mean, power. Um, I'm thinking. You asked me a question. Can you let me think? See, power seems like the easy answer, though. Maybe it's not a trick question, though. 
All right, we're gonna say power. Power. Family. Ah, fuck. <laughs> Our family. I was to be its heart, to uphold life, ensure continuity. I know, stability, Vargas. Never to oppose it. Huh? Guess your Nobu's instructions were a little different. Yorinobu raised his hand against our father, but he is an Arasaka. He is family. I do not expect you to understand. I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly. That it is difficult. Okay, but why did you change your mind? Mm -hmm. He's your brother. It's been hard, it'll be hard. He'll Let's be hard. Get that. But what changed your mind? We received a warning during the parade. Security protocols were violated. You think? The first doubts sprouted <laughs> then. They grew yet greater in your hideout <laughs> when my brother's assault group arrived not to rescue, but to kill. Yurinobu was just plain willing to sacrifice you. Yep. My father was right about my brother. He never cared for us. I was brought up to be the heart of the family. It is time for the Arasakas to listen to their heart. Listen to it will heart. bring justice. Did you bring Soul Killer? As we agreed, you Finger would. Finger on the trigger. Don't say a word. Oh, hey, guys. Something got you spooked? Seem on edge. Something got you spooked? I don't know. You don't know. Three times now that AB has flown by. <laughs> That's true. Think someone might have told you. We must not get distracted. Did you bring Soul Killer? Listen, if you took this seriously and you didn't want to get found, you could have worn a hoodie instead of walking around in your extremely good looking white dress with your extremely good looking gold arms. Okay, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Because I don't understand. Let's get going. Does she have something up her butt? She stiffens them up. It's because she's, she's worried. Take me for a fool. Take me for a fool. Think I'd fall for that? Got plans to walk out of here alive. Had I any ill intentions, I would have chosen a side far more discreet. Not really. Than People this. fall out of windows all the time. We are here because I know how to save your life. I can lead you to Mikoshi. Minen, Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do. And one is very near. Where? Here in Night City. Beneath. She's Arasaka so pretty. <laughs> she's so pretty. We ought to leave. Right now. Johnny, she's so pretty. Wanna leave. What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. This is gonna be a disaster. Sit. Okay. We have little time. And you'll help me in exchange for. He's so mad. My brother. You catch a whiff of that? Smells like shit. He's so mad. Not to step in it. He must be made to take responsibility for his deeds. Hi, Sam. It's not an inconspicuous look. I agree. I'm not drinking that drink. Just say it. Be easier that way. I want him punished. Still uh vague. You want him dead. I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How you plan to do Don't they already know? Yorinobu. Hanako-sama. Soro-soro gojitaku ni omodori itadaite. Sugu ni sumu wa. Yorinobu will soon call a meeting of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father. I just death. love the glaring. I will get you into this meeting, and you will testify against my brother. <laughs> testify. Listen, mind if I'm straight with you. I'm bisexual, so I do mind. But I just love how Johnny is. <laughs> Johnny is over here, like. <laughs> Like he wants to rip her throat out. <laughs> what the fuck? He hates it. Yeah, he's like a cat taking a bath. Chris, hello. How da morning? Uh, hello. <laughs> You're now the lady for us. I am. Oh, incredible. 
Or maybe Helicurvian round with you. Yeah, ex in instead of whatever this is. Help me get rid of Yorinobu. I will help you get rid of the construct. Let's assume it works. Then what? You take the Arasaka throne? Where would you get that idea? Oh, <laughs> you Ronnie. Is a given. Besides, Takamura said you were supposed to step in for Yorinobu here in Night City. Everyone must know their place, V. Is that a threat? That is a fact my brother has never understood. What an extremely weird thing to say, considering the circumstances. Face, and I have no wish to change it. <laughs> no wish or no permission? No wish to or no permission. You being oh. I decide my own fate. As should you. So a little suspicious. Johnny looks like a child that really wants to show that it doesn't like someone. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Don't like what I'm hearing, but I gotta think I gotta oh, think about intriguing. it. Need to think about it. Naturally. But think quickly. Yorinobu is on high alert after the parade. He may harbor suspicions. Let's fly the fuck out of here. V, do you feel all right? I'm a very angry man in my uh, head. <laughs> you are bleeding. Oh yeah, I do that all the time. It's on purpose, don't worry. Fuck. It seems you are running out of time. Also, there isn't anything on my hand. Don't delay. Make your uh, decision. Oh, think it over. You could use some air right now. Okay. It does. Oh shit. It does. <laughs> is the rain outside the window was such a vibe? Just hanging out here. Staring at the window. It is kind of cozy. Oh man, it was storming yesterday when I went to bed. It was a very cozy. I warned you. What, what are you doing? Shit, be hours from it now, V. What? You can't stand on your own two feet. Hours from what? Well, I'm good to go. Body listens to me. See what I'm getting at? No, not really. Are you a, are you being a jerk? Of course I can see. Want me to hand over the keys? I want to save your life. I, uh, Pop some pseudo endotrizine. Scooch and let me get behind To do door. what? I'll get us to fucking Makoshi. How would you do that? How exactly? Without that porcelain cunt's help, that's for damn sure. Yeah, but like, what is what is the plan, Johnny? That, but that's why I'll bring Rogue. She's not rusted through just yet. Plus, she owes me. For Maybe what? She stuck her neck out for you a half a century ago, but now. I don't see it. I'll convince her. After all, we know a thing or two about ops like this. Yeah, but wh why would she we'll care? We'll blast our way into Sokka Tower, just like we did back in the day. Then find the way inside Makoshi. It's our only chance. Oh, God. What about Pan Am? She wanted to help, too. What? What about Pan Am? She offered help. Listen up, V. Those guys are trailer tuggers. Are you being rude to Pan Am now? on Arasaka is just not another convoy to Jack. You already tried this with amateurs. Both know how that ended. You died you last time. Tried it with pros. Thank you. It didn't end any fucking better. You don't want those people involved. Their lives on the line. Possibly on your conscience. Our one hope is sitting at the afterlife right now, and her name is Rogue. You even believe this could work? Do you do you believe this could work? I kind of do want to do that Rogue. instead of Hanako. I don't know. Because she's you still Arasaka, you know? <laughs> With her experience, her resources, her connections. Won't find anyone better in But MC. there's something with Rogue she hasn't it's told us. Work. We breached the tower. Alt cracks open Makoshi. Then I fuck up that. Great, you checking out again? Johnny, she hasn't told us everything though. I don't know that she's just gonna help us like that. What? Am I... Oh, am I in the head now instead of in my body? No, not what you say. Oh, okay. Well, that is what I thought, so thank you. <laughs> Easy there. Don't move just yet. They get dragged out of the elevator? I'm not- I'm not doing so hot. <laughs> You're in pain, I know. Delirious when you arrived, so I had to dose you with beta-haloperidol. Oh my god. 
Oof. But light oversensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. My head. Ah. Uh. Almost done stabilizing the biochip. Thanks, Dad. It was like someone's using your head as a knife block. Yes. How? How did I get here? Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. How did I do that? Probably Johnny did then that. You shoved my patient at the time off the table and demanded you. That be was definitely Johnny. Delamint was your guardian. <laughs> Johnny, huh? what the fuck? I, uh, <laughs> I wasn't completely myself. The whispering. I know. That's a bit worrying. Delamint was your guardian angel. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Just give it to me straight, Vic. You can't hear my mouth, Vic. You've come to a critical juncture. I know, the game told me. Try sitting up carefully. I'll try. Think I'm gonna <laughs> Yeah, why are you whispering? But yeah, yeah. fish. So slowly. I was double jumping not two seconds ago. Yeah. I see Terrace. Hello. Another victory for the history book. Sitting up. Hmm. Victor? Well, looks like I can sit up, all right. But I can tell you don't have good news. I'm dying again. How much longer is this going to go on? One stream. You tell me. Presumably. Looking at Maybe you, two. not long at all. It could be two. You don't know that. Next attack, you won't be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? What options do I have? Yeah, I know. Thoughts on where to start? Jesus, again. Do I have to spell it out? I did just have an attack. It's in your hands, not mine, and not those of that thing in your head. Are you calling Johnny a thing now? Technically saved me. Now, see that setup over there? Yeah. What about it? You'll find a last dose of pseudo endo in there. <laughs> Gift from Misty. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Want to give in to the voices in your head? Go ahead. Take a puff. Go silent. Is this the choice about either attacking or not? Or find another way. End things on your own. Is terms. that why there's a gun there too? Get a little present for me over there too blockers manage to walk those few yards to the table the rest will be up to you and you alone well, a little bit of johnny johnny is not you gonna like being called him. a thing <laughs> got one last chance i'm taking the wheel but and you're no but, Rogue, but you're a dumbass johnny johnny only way this is gonna work. johnny you're a mega dumbass enough johnny i just I should have read hello. I gotta think about it. Need to stretch, stretch your noodle? noodle. Fine. Fine. Just not, Just not in this basement. V, Christ, you're talking out loud. I, yeah, out loud. yep. What? Yep. Just go fix this thing. Think I can do it. Oh, Whatever I'm racing. You decide. Let's make sure to get out of here first. Take a gun and pills. All of them? All of them. Oh, all of them. Okay. I'm probably just gonna let him do his thing, though. Because, cause, okay, between between Arasaka and Johnny, you know. Oh, yeah, the never-ending fights. Who won the bout? Oh, so you heard that. Did he get up? Walsh? Was it? Uh, what? No, nope. never does. Meaning? It's a rerun. One I like to go back. That to. makes a lot of sense now. Why'd you get so mad then? If you already knew who won. Oh no, really? Guess I like to think about where Walsh might have tripped up. Is this an allegory? Any theories? Entering the ring against a stronger opponent, but feels a little strange to call that a mistake. Can't thank you enough for all you've done, Vic. Only wish I could have done more. Go on now. I want to close up. Forever. Take the meds and 
do what you gotta do, V. Thanks, Vic. To digitize yeah. douchebag? I'm doing my best. And you hang in there, too. Nah, Vic is great. Good luck, kid. Victor really did the most. Crawl to the table, skip around, la da Yeah. <laughs> Honestly. How does that go? Wait, Pan Am isn't actually an option, is she? Is she actually an option? Hey, Misty. Hey, V, I heard. Well, your thoughts. Oh, God. You shouldn't have had to. No, it's not a real question. Sorry. <laughs> it's not that. Hi, Mike. No Hello. I know what's going on. I'm dying, Misty. And I know it will be. Hi, Trav. Be easy Hello. For either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. <laughs> sure. Got a feeling Vic's had enough of me as is. Don't be mad at him. I'm not. His chakras are all blocked up today. <laughs> Plus, he's had too much coffee. You ever just have too much Let coffee in your chakras? My aura's sputtering. Mm hmm. Afraid so. Violently. Sure. Lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Jackie? What, what's he got to do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. But Jackie's dead. Are we going to the grave? <laughs> Misty, I have very limited time. Are you the Grim Reaper, Misty? Misty, are you the Grim Reaper right now? Top floor. He had the same hey, Alicia. face. Hey, Alicia. Hello. Oh, Jack. This is it, Chica. I'm done for. Doesn't sound like the Jackie I knew. That was a long time ago. His mom had just found out he'd signed up with the Valentinos. Oop. Trust me. Senora Wells on one shoulder, your gang Chumbas on the other. No choice can ever seem right. Mm hmm. Life wasn't easy for my Jackie, but he found the courage to bet on himself. And he's dead now. After. I brought him here. Also, he is dead now. I just, I don't want to say that out loud to you because that feels mean, but. <clears throat> oh, that's more like it. Air. See that? Am I going to sit down too? Nope. I come here when I need to get away. Be alone with my thoughts. She's on to something. Ought to sit, mull through some shit yourself. Hmm. Hi, Sarasaka with me? Why not? <laughs> Let's go together. You're right. Choice spot. So what? What did Jackie decide up here? Oh, no. <clears throat> to die? Gonna be a legend in this city. Oh, yeah, well. Hmm. And I'm gonna leave you alone now. Oh. Oh, okay. Take your time. Bye. Love you. Fucking scared me, know that? What, to secure your Thought soul you right there? Your way out. Do you? Oh, so did yeah. you care? For now. Are you worried about me? You know, you should call anyone you want to say goodbye to. Oh, God. Worst case scenario. That what you expect? No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. If things don't go our way, just fucking do it. Anyone you gotta talk to, now's the time. Pills can wait. Can they though? Call Judy. Oh. Judy. Yeah. Even I've grown to. You like better. Her. She's perfect. She ought to know that. Hey, Judy. Oh, hey, V. What's cracking? Still waiting in that apartment? Ha ha. Oh yeah. When swimming. <laughs> A lot of fun, wasn't it? What you said then, about what you sensed in me. Death. Oh. High time I faced it. Can't be sure it'll work, but I gotta try. Listen, whatever it is you're gonna try, just be careful, okay? I'm here waiting. Thanks. Do my best. That's it. It's over. That's the okay. first sign. Was good you called. Wish I'd had the chance to. 
come a long way to get here, haven't we? Just think, it all started in a fucking landfill. <laughs> then you tried to kill me. He did. Thank you. <laughs> See exactly what I mean. Trying to save your sorry hide now. You can let me do that. Or you can try Pan Am and her tarmac rats. But then their lives will weigh heavy on your soul. Or you take Arasaka's deal, but then you'll have your own soul on your conscience. Oh my god. You actually can ask Pan Am for help? I kind of want to see it through Hijani, though. At least for my first playthrough. Just because it kind of feels like it's a full circle moment. Either that or a repeating of the same mistakes moment. You know, it's one of the two. But they've learned so much now. I don't know. Being a legend for a crime, aren't the best and most legendary criminals the ones who no, no one knows about? Or you only know their... Uh, their, their code name, I guess. Misty kind of looks like that lost replicant in Blade Runner. A little. Maybe that's where they got it from. Looking at the soul killer ad on a building is so creepy. I know. Jackie's a legend and a badass drink in the afterlife. He's also dead. Aw, Liddy. We must not disappoint our wife. I'm going to face death. Yeah, just be careful. <laughs> I think I want to go with Johnny. I think I I don't like Arasaka. Uh, specifically, also, I just don't in general. I don't want Panam to lose more people. I'm gonna go with Johnny. I think you ought to go with Rogue. Two of you together got the best shot. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. Could also just put all this to rest. Yo, I'm a little curious. <laughs> I feel like doing that. You, uh, you brought the gun. I'm gonna do the thing. Of course, I saved. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. You're up, Johnny. I trust you. I'm gonna do the thing. Take the wheel. Just <clears throat> go easy on us, yeah? Thanks, B. I'll get us through this. You'll see. One way or another? Hi, Marshall. Oh. See you on the other side. Even if I gotta burn this whole fucking city down. Look who we have here. It's me. You know, me. You know the weirdest thing, though? What? Hey there, V. Drop in for one last drink before turning in? Almost like they was one person. Ugh, horseshit. Calling me a light. Oh, yeah. I'm saying it was hotter than Satan's ass cracked down in Salvador. People saw all kinds of crap. Last, I'm, I'm just, just getting, getting started. Oh, too bad. We're closing up. I'm looking for Rogue. Big booth over there. Is it the same choice? I probably don't want to disturb her now. No, I think I do. Wait, no, I'm serious. She'll kick you in the can. That what you think? Then just, just watch and learn. Oh, I'll watch, but I doubt I'll be the one to get a lesson. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, I feel like I should take the break first. Because the break is starting in like nine-ish minutes. Uh, I don't have tea. And I, I'm expecting that there will be cutscenes that I don't want to interrupt in the middle. Okay, I'll let you have that one first. <laughs> Metal arm, Jesus, take the wheel, Nuke Side City again. We'll see. <laughs> Speaking of cats, I'll be right back.
Okay. Kids? It is time. It is time. Da 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 etc. I'm gonna get and then dance 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 dance. <laughs> Roast me, bye. <laughs> Thank you for the resub. Johnny is gonna sit in my head for the rest of his life, I think. Whoops. Hi, Kaminari. Hello, and thank you for welcome back. Oh. Don't get in my way. How are you doing? You're running your little operation only because I have allowed it. And I can change my mind whenever I want. Really? Are you guys having an actual conversation? Hang on, give me a sec. V. Ha. <sighs> Try again, Rogue. Got one more guess. Johnny. Hello. We'll talk soon, Wakako. What do you want, Johnny? Oh, Jesus, who died? Not happy to see me. Well, I mean, technically Johnny did. Frankly, I'm not sure. Why? We had fun at the movies, didn't we? We're not at the movies anymore. Plus, got a good idea why you're here. Oh, why? You want something. Yeah. And that's always a bad sign. <laughs> yeah, I do. <laughs> Pretty tight setup you got, Rogue. Queen of Night City. Couldn't have been easy to achieve all this. So many others failed. The hell's that supposed to mean? <gasps> Are you finally gonna tell me? Trying to fill in some gaps. Somehow missed the last 50 years. Just trying to get my facts straight. Fill in some gaps. And? You learn anything useful? Just that no one from our old crew got a happy ending. No one but you. You want to talk about it? I'm just curious! Rogue! I <laughs> just want to know! I'm running with you. I wouldn't hey, like that freaking out of 80. We're close! <laughs> oh, what gives? Now. We ain't finished yet! You're just oh, standing yes, where... Shish, what's the matter? Nothing. Your shift's done. You're heading home to kick your feet up. Okay. Guess I'm gonna go back to work. We'll have the whole place to ourselves. Hmm. VIP treatment. You gonna now beat talk. me up? Just what the hell are you insinuating? Don't beat me up. Is that my bottle behind the bar? Is that my bottle behind the bar? Yep. Been waiting there. Just... I never knew what the fuck for. <laughs> but I'm starting to get some good ideas about how I might Are you gonna break it. it over my head? You thought? Oh, God. Chose a cozy life for yourself. I'm just curious what it cost you. We all pay a price for the choices we make. I'm no exception. You're sold out. Now, what you tell yourself when you're cashing corp checks? That's what I tell myself when I stand over the graves of the crew from the Atlantis. It's what I tell myself when I look at you now. And when I'm dead. Well, hey. The past is the past. That's I've been right. dead for some time. But that's not why you're here. No. You want to drag me into something again, and this chatter is just a prelude. <laughs> this body, I'm trying to... I... no. Fuck! V's dying, and I'm the fucking cancer killing her. But the process can be stopped. I just have to... No, Johnny. Don't start. Don't tell yourself you're out to help someone. It's only ever about you. So you can feel better. I don't think that's true anymore. I think he's genuinely changed. You sure about that? I think he's yeah. actually changed. Same as it was with No, Bolt. I don't think so. It wasn't even about guilt that. He's done some Just soul some searching, literally. Sense of personal discomfort. <laughs> well, maybe I've changed. I'm running out of time, Rogue. When that fucking clock strikes 12, Johnny will disappear and V will go with him. Need to get myself out of her head before that happens. We managed to contact Alt. She agreed to help. Well, Alt. But? Only one place we can do it. The data fort. Mikoshi. And the only access point we got a chance of reaching is tucked snugly under Sokka Tower. Yep. Arasaka? Yep. Again? Yep. 
Should have seen what that. What about we can kill Smasher? Are you not looking forward to that? Only an idiot does the same thing <laughs> over and over yeah. while expecting things to work out differently. Yeah, well, I'm an idiot, Rogue. What did you expect? <laughs> You even have a plan for this? Literally, Carrie. Literally. Well? The fuck plans! I need people in gear. No, I need you to plan you're it. You're the best fixer in you town. You know what you're doing. You tell me how we're gonna do this. Did you say we? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's right. Can't possibly work without you. When you're the best of friends. So what? I dust off and load up my tsunami. Rejoin your crusade against Arasaka. It's not really. Bingo. Well, okay, well, I guess. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's changed exactly. Yeah, that doesn't make him likable no. necessarily. It's... Hmm. And what makes you think I'd agree? You owe me one. You owe it to yourself. He said you owe me one, but I don't know what for. Owe it to yourself. Is that so? Yeah. Sure, you can just be the queen of the ball in Night City. But that's not the real rogue. The real rogue you buried while you climbed to the top. Look deep. I know you can find her again. Shit. Knew this would happen one day. <laughs> I enjoy watching him, yes. That one night, exactly. by some fucking miracle, you'd waltz in here and tear everything down. Bed Some fencing? things never change. They're already full, Rogue. Why are you filling them more? And With us, what? Is it a mix? We changed? I don't know. Well, what do you say we go find out? And then Judy walks into the bar. <laughs> Will you lend me a hand? Shut the fuck up, Johnny. Just stop talking. Okay. We still got there. We still got there. <laughs> and I appreciate a top that tells you to survive. And we thought we would never get there. Oh, she got her other gear on too. Am I dead on the floor? Or um, did we just sleep? She does come in army. She really does. See, she got her old gear on. And I am phasing in and out of consciousness. That is uh, okay. That can cry. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> every time, every time. Never have I seen one not drunk as a pig sleep over twenty hours. Next time, I'll punch some holes in that toothy grin. Very weird. I remember that face. Gotta be crisp. As I guess, I maybe don't be rude immediately. If your dad. Blood of the blood. But what did I miss? Why are you here? The boss will explain. The boss. Where's the boss? Rogue. There is only one boss. Let's go. Is that a yes or a awaits. no? I don't think that's a yes or a no. Sure, Judy would be allowed into afterlife unless she had a gig to offer someone. Why wouldn't she, though? Did they not like Judy? Life goals look as good as Rogue at the age of 80? Life goals is to move as well as Rogue at the age of 80. Rogue. See, you two said your hellos. Excellent. Loot. Rogue, what's this specimen doing here? He's our pilot and our ride to Corpo Plaza today. The specimen. Rogue. You were the best. Of course, Rogue. your sorry ass wouldn't be here otherwise. Gears over there. Help yourself. Okay, I will loot everything. Don't mind if I do. The over tour? The prejudice? The ammo? Wait, are you actually something I would actually want to use? Because I don't think I would. I should technically use his Malorian, shouldn't I? I should use his Malorian. Just because it, it, it's Johnny. It would only make sense. That the overture is a quest item. But is it really? Power assault weapon? 
I looted too much stuff again, didn't I? You bet I did. I gotta equip this Malorian. This is too important. Oh! <laughs> but she's Judy and I love her. She should be allowed anywhere. But I'm not specced into guns, so it's not that good for me. Johnny, you'll need gear. I know. God, I'm picking up a lot of stuff. Take gear optional. Is it optional? Hold on. I don't need all these. I cannot destroy those. That's very interesting. I mean, I'm not going to use any of the other ones, am I? No. That's a big axe. Holy. Okay. Hi, Ozzy. You're here to dish out spoilers? I mean, if you do, you'll get insta-banned. <laughs> I'm also at the end of the game. Oh, wait. Actually. Wait up. Okay, no, that's fair. <laughs> I'm done. Oh, I'm not done. I also have to take retro thrusters? What are these? They're retro thrust thrusters. Retro thrusters. thrusters? Antigrams. That's what they are. Strap them to your legs and you can jump from damn near any height. Christ, Johnny, I'm not your fucking babysitter. I don't know. I just got here. Okay, now. Gonna tell me what the plan is? Yep. Jack in the shard. No, Jack in the grave. That was at the start of the game. Well, hey! Oh, Jackie deserves better. Point in Arasaka Tower. Need to reach the lab floor. Hold it just long enough to do what we need to do, then get out alive. Arasaka Tower's a fortress. The most secure building in Night City. Walking in through the front door just ain't an option. So... We'll get in through a window of our own. We will become the Kool-Aid Man and crash through the wall. We fly in on a Militech Strix tactical bomber. Close enough. First, we rain fire on the building's air defenses from a high altitude. Then we breach a wall on the 76th floor, jump from the AV, and are there survive trees? the landing thanks to our anti -grabs. Seems like there are trees. That's right. We'll land smack in the middle of a tropical rainforest. That's so cute! Contrary to popular opinion, Arasaka has... Panache, at times. We cut our way through the jungle to a shaft located on the tower's vertical axis. The shaft runs the height of the building. We use our retro thrusts again. Reach the bottom floor quickly. We'll surprise the socks off security. They'll be in disarray. This Resistance should surprise be Surprise the socks off. We hit the lab floor running. Reach the access point. The rest will be in your hands. I'll hold for applause. As I said, there's oh. only one boss, one queen. One queen. I even play Cyberpunk? I'm here to see if it's really as bad as people say it is. It's not. It's really good, actually. It has been fixed a lot. An absolute lot, actually. I don't know people still think it's really bad, and I guess it didn't Johnny get a very good... I'm not. I'm talking a lot, actually. <laughs> uh, thanks for warning us not to read your messages. Jinzy, yes. <laughs> Sorry for two seconds. Almost did the good old safety ban. I get it. Are Arasaka the good guys here? They have a rainforest. Chances of jungle warfare in the middle of Mega City are low, but never zero! And the plan for getting out is? Who said we were getting out? I was crying at your joke. You're welcome. <laughs> the end times are truly upon us. Sheesh. Didn't say you had a bomber. We all have our secrets. Guess nowadays a slick red Mezutani just doesn't cut it. How'd you get that? I'm the best fixer in town, idiot. Yeah, said. idiot. Now focus on the plan. <laughs> Say no more! <laughs> Saying we're gonna rain fire on these assholes. <laughs> know what I mean? Seriously? I've waited too long for this. Don't bust out of your pants just yet. Too late, I came. If we want to survive, we gotta do a lot more. Here comes the tricky bit. Who says I want to survive? We're gonna knock a Jerujan 0401 comsat off its orbit. Blood clot satellite. We're gonna make history friends. That'll freeze comms in NC, NorCal, and SoCal. Should buy us three or four hours. That's a lot of hours to be no in one place. No coordination, no support. <clears throat> but unless chaos. I start talking again in the middle. 
Not even gonna ask how. It's because she's the best fixer in town. I'm not even gonna ask how. Got a certain acquaintance. You're telling me anyway. Here. Mystery benefactor. Highly positioned informant. I'll pay him enough to give us access to the Jerujan. The rest will be up to our old Netrunner friend. Which one? You mean all. Okay. Only one I know who can rip an Arasaka satellite out of the sky. Let's go, team. <laughs> Who's your contact at Orbital Air? Contacts at Orbital Air, eh? You really are the queen of fixers. Better be grateful. Called on my best assets for you. I know, I can tell. Oh, you meant people. Okay, of course. Brew all this up while I was asleep? Actually, I brewed it up while you were dead. Oh, you've already been thinking about this. The comms okay. High, when corp conflicts start to heat up again, could be worth gold. Because nothing stands to make you more at ease than war. You're one of those now? All has got net watch on her ass? <laughs> I'm supposed to talk Please. to Alt anyway. I'll convince her. Don't fuck this up, Johnny. It's the one thing I can't do. For Said I'd do it, and I will. Don't yell at her. So summing up, we fly to Arasaka Tower on She doesn't have a badass at. The welcome basket of <laughs> exactly. Yeah, that's just then become rogue. In, find the building's vertical axis and work our way down. To the Makoshi access point. Yep. What'd you think? <laughs> so, Arasaka will know it was you. Will they? See just one problem. There's no coming back from this. You'll burn bridges. To ash and dust. All Arasaka's gonna be gunning for you. Yeah. Probably Orbital Air will too. But as I see it, they braided this whip that's gonna sting them. Uh, they kind of did. So? I think what do you, you have think? great ideas. Plan's got a lot of holes. I like it! <laughs> Love a good amount of gaping holes. But fuck it, it's gotta work. It won't be the stupidest stunt we've ever pulled. Rogue? What? Just thank you. Thank me later. Oh. There's still the matter of all. Oh? <laughs> Do you know how to move It's a bad year for herbal air. <laughs> well, V got some practice under her belt. I could pull off Rogue's sure, hair, manage. you think, though? Head out back. Well, I don't know about that. Nick's Maybe. Ropes. I don't know that a side shave would actually look good and on you, me. Wayland, heat up the Strix. We'll be with you soon. Okay. How long you gonna be? Might I have time for a nap? Ha 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 ha. I'm so now. Never argue with a dinosaur. You will get. Oh my god, Gorgon. <laughs> oh, right! Hey, so you the one gonna die, right? What happens here if you've killed him? Like, accidentally, obviously. Serious question. Who is here if he's dead? Because he can, he can have his brain fried if you mess up. Hmm. <laughs> Jesus is the Ned Runner? Johnny has such a way with words, right? Hair grows back and it's an experiment. Uh, yeah, but I like stream for a living. So yes and no. <laughs> you cannot kill him. Oh, I thought people said that if I didn't save him with the hack, he would get his brain fried. Okay. That is the plan. Right on. Hop into a suit. Then have a seat over there. Oh, God. I'm finishing up for the day. So you be resurfacing on your own. Oh no. And don't fuck with my gear. Why would you leave? <laughs> Thank you for the minis, Landar. Oh wow, I look terrible. I mean, okay, the suit is not even that bad, but the shoes kind of ruined the fit. My outfit! I picked it special! Then will you vevings. If you want to hide your hair? Do you just hate me? Because <laughs> absolutely not. Beanies? Ugh. Please. That's a real tight jumpsuit, right? You can see everything. Alt. Alt, baby. Baby doll. Darling. Sweetheart. Hi. 
Alt Cunningham is no more. You are. You're just being weird about it. Then why keep her appearance? That's so? Then why do I see her in front of me? You see Alt because you wish to. It's a defense mechanism. A lie! Your explicit memory is simply creating a replacement image. It's weird. Having like a bad a, dream. You read my thoughts? An over <laughs> You're just very predictable. You still deny what you are. A construct. <laughs> a set of data. Wow. I know you. You know me. You can my run off into the sunset. Home. Together. So why even bother talking if you know my thoughts? As action precedes reaction, so Johnny Silverhand speaks before he thinks. <laughs> huh, that's some kind of joke? <laughs> Only a sliver of memory from Alt's sense of humor. She said, I can't read your minds because you're a dumbass and you don't think. What else do you know? So what else? It is, I'm at the end, yes. No. Or, well, I'm doing the, complexity the end quests. Of emotions. Time is short. Netwatch could detect our local net traffic. Okay, I know how to get into Mako. Know anything about satellites? How much you know about satellites? Did you reach 0401? I can manage it. Holy fuck, you're doing it now. You're I agree mine. with the plan. <laughs> We'll get you inside Arasaka. Okay, but I kind of love this because, in essence, they, they said we are not going to have you repeat the entire plan again, okay? It was long enough the first time. We're going to skip and we're going to give it a good reason. <laughs> I love that. A hologram intimidating you with her boobs? I mean, Johnny is apparently doing that himself. There's still some alt left. Exactly, Sue Terrace. Can you just hold on a second? You will breach Arasaka Tower and locate the port into Mikoshi. This is the program that will establish the link. I will send it with you on a splinter. Upon your opening of a back door, I will be able to circumvent the data fort's security protocols. And once that's done... You will be separated from V. And Mikoshi will cease to exist. You're not afraid of this? Wait, why would she be? No fear. No, you don't. I'm Something so intimidated. Oh no. <laughs> fear is the wrong word. Oh, what about the constructs inside? Yeah, what about them? Cease to exist, as will the constructs inside, right? No. The data constructs will not be destroyed. Will they be free? They will become part of something oh greater. god, the phrasing makes that terrible. Nope, keep trying. Don't <laughs> because it is not something you can understand. Because you don't want to tell me. Shut up! You just don't want to tell me. Suspicious. Fine, have it your way. Is that everything? There's one other thing. There is? Look, wait. Just one other thing. I have no more time for you. What? Know what? Know what? Think you were right. Alt's gone. Oh, for Christ. Perfect. Go on. Fuck off. <laughs> Fuck this. Oh, Johnny. Oh, buddy. Why is this red? Out of all the things that are. Oh! Well, she didn't say no. Probably because she's using us also. Oh. Can look my reflection? Do I look like Johnny right now? I don't know if you can hear me, but <clears throat> well, thanks. Oh, okay. <laughs> trusting me. Let's do this. I could all like that. He's like he seems like he actually does care about what happens. Oh. I feel like he cares what happens to V. I feel like he actually does. And maybe I'm being very... What's the word for that? Maybe I'm being naive, but I feel like he cares. Yeah, everything's fine. Got no reason to worry. <clears throat> well... <laughs> now, pull over. Kill the engine and have a nice long look at the stars. Simply that. You won't regret it. 
Who's gonna die? Gotta go. Is it me? I love you. I love you? Biggest raid of your life in that getup? Really? Thank you. Thank you for reminding me. Because now, absolutely not. What? Not catching my good side? Won't exactly shed many bullets, but that's your problem. <laughs> Thank you so much for letting me know, Rogue. Rogue. <laughs> Rogue. Who is that? My son. You have a son? That. You telling me you, uh, you got a, uh... Private life. Yeah. And we'll leave it at that. Asked if everything's ready. Hate when people have private lives. Yeah, it's ready. Good. Now come on. See, you say that, Riodon, but not really. Because that's not how it started out, one. And two, his entire life, he's been caring about people. Like, people who are really, really close. People who he loved dearly or said he loved dearly. And then he still fucked them over. It was always just Johnny, Johnny, Johnny. His entire life, Johnny, Johnny, Johnny. Until now. And it still took forever to get him to realize that his behavior was messed up. It took so long. And I did a lot of side questing. For better or worse, he will develop, yeah. It does depend on the player and what way he develops, really? Or that lunatic will take off without us. Can he become an even worse person? <laughs> Private lives in this capitalist hellscape? Yeah, it couldn't be me. Am I still wearing the things? Yes, I am, okay. I am following you. I like this joint. Gonna miss it. You think you're gonna die? I think we're gonna die together, at least. If anything. To the very top. Yes, ma'am. So, Waylon, what'd you tell him? He's really not coming, Harry. Exactly. He's really not. Only what he wanted to know. <clears throat> His cut. Oop. He any good? Aiming to be an NC legend before long. Well, that's gonna happen right now. <laughs> we all. Oops. I love her shirt. Honestly, love her shirt. No bread snake? I was feeling a bread snake, I'll be honest. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. But it's okay. We'll be dead together. Not this time, honey. <laughs> Wayland, take us up. I'm going to mute alerts. Don't do anything. <laughs> I feel like it's important. Soundtrack. I believe we're actually doing this. I swear this is the same soundtrack as from when we did Arasaka Tower the first time. Just like old times, yeah? Just like old times. You know what I like most about Night City? What did that be? Not being in it. Take a look. See that? One day you're in the gutter, the next, you got the whole city at your feet. The whole fucking city! Where no one can make you do shit! Not even those motherfuckers! No idea how this is gonna end, but let me tell ya, it'll be one loud morning. <laughs> Time we gave this city another wake up call. Wake up, Samurai? We've got a city to burn? <laughs> Jesus, it's so beautiful. About to get even prettier, too. The hell you say? You two take a puff and not share with <laughs> I wish, Squama. Eyes on the sky, everybody. Cutting a mixer entrance in three, 
two. And one. Whoa, was that the Jerujin? Well, that's the one she Make listed. I wish that Johnny has a happy ending, hey, and so does Rogue. They got a lock on us. Damn it. What do we do? Stick to the plan. It's all right. I brought knives and berserks. Like an homage sort of sci-fi that was around that inspired Cyberpunk. That would make sense. Hi, Clay. Dropping nuke two. That's whoop. Fuck. The plan. Get us out of here. Too late. Time to dump this pack. Got to improvise. Raymond, get us to the top floors. Can you? He seems pretty happy about it. Shit. Rogue? <laughs> the cackling? It's Johnny's theme. Oh, I thought his other one was Johnny's theme. Okay, unmute. Fuck me. You still breathing? Yup. Afraid so. Just a little bit of blood, don't worry about it. Crashed by the waterfall. I'll try to reestablish contact with him, then find someone who's got access for the elevator going down. Wayland, you read me? How many pieces you in? Still one, I hope. And I think the local tribe's taken an interest in me. We'll get you out of there. Don't move. As if I could. <laughs> We're going after Wayland. All right, let's go get him. That seems like it was a choice, but I feel like I mean that's what I want to do, right? I want to follow Rogue optional. Please. Hey yo. Yeah. What about them? What about the guards? What about the guards? What about the guards? What about the guards? I'm not even gonna loot y'all. Yo, I'm not even gonna loot. I'm not gonna loot anything. Not a single thing is gonna get looted. You know that? Just gonna, I'm not gonna do it. Welcome back! Hello, hello, thank you so much for that raise out! Let's get to work. Hey, Wayland, you hear me? The moment that I'm coming with the others. Doors all night. Oop! We each get one. Johnny, choice is yours. What do you mean? Phone, Find the commanding officer? Well, obvious. Suspicious activity. I know, they're. Oh! Uh, actually, I take all of them. <laughs> They're all mine. You're supposed to jump with us. Don't like all enemies in one big pool. What do you mean? Decided to ripple them so, out. Hi, Patrick. <laughs> nice. Mind me a lot of your old man. What? But you're too young. Not to... now. <laughs> no, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I just know things. I just know things. Six million months later, I got a cortisone injection scheduled for my back. Nice! Finally! Shouldn't these guard like cheese? I mean, I have two berserks and very soon after a third one. I, I'm practically immortal. Then I have a, a second heart. And I'm pretty sure that... Oh, what's it called? What's it called again? I'm pretty sure that the tuner also slowly uh, reduces the cooldown on the second heart. See that one? A high ranker holding the access we need. Oh. All yours, Johnny. Okay. <laughs> I wait for the Stay hey, boy scout. Spider Murphy loves to say. Look at the cat dragged in. <laughs> Let's grab the access token and make for the elevator. Okay. Got the access token. Now the elevator. What the fuck's going on? What the fuck? You know how it is. Okay, I did loot something. Have a good day, Lenny. Have a really good time, I hope. 
You guys, uh... Okay, well, one of them's gonna go. Of course we're on to Don't get yourself spotted. What do you mean, don't get yourself spotted? Why? Why wouldn't we? Why wouldn't we? Well, just get yourself spotted anyway. Maybe they don't notice us. We'll just kill everyone. I don't know why they're still upset. I'm clearly capable of killing everyone. This is way better than my 360. Well, <laughs> surprise. <laughs> My, I made this rig specifically for Cyberpunk in the past. But this was literally ages and ages and ages back when it was first announced, when the specs were first announced. So yeah, everyone's alive! We're doing great! Don't worry about it. Did we become a space marine? Well, we have an extra one. It's cyberware. The atrium. Jesus. It was just a month ago I met with Michiko Arasaka here. Did you have a good time? Empty hallways, offices. Just like back then. Remember? Why is it empty? Do. You've changed, you know? Finally grown up. I know! You're still the best. So, security rooms are on the lower level. You'll need to plow through. I- you mean- you mean I have to kill a lot of people? On purpose? Like, you're asking me to do that? Fan-fucking-tastic. Fucking elevators are still jammed. Gotta jump. That's a long way down. Precisely why I told you to bring the antigraphs. What do you mean, bring them? They're on my feet. Whomst? <laughs> Whomst? Oh yeah, I've been excited for Cyberpunk since forever. And then when it came out that they had a ton of bugs, I still didn't play it. Because I was determined to play the best version of this game. And now, I am. See you down bottom. Are we all jumping together? Are you jumping first? I'm gonna just quick say real quick. <laughs> Whee! Which way now? Uh, Security. Hey. Am I even gonna need Berserk for you? Nice try, buddy. Where's the... Where's the guy? Where's the... Where is someone's floating? Are you fighting me or not? You can never tell. Ah, yes, you're coming down. Okay, hold it. Another one! Target's hit. Target's hit. Target doesn't care. Target's made of stronger stuff than that, buddy. Oh, there's one up there, too. Okay, well, they can come down eventually, I guess. If they want to. We're still in combat, but are we actually? That's not, that's not security. Are you security? Are you security? No, it is upstairs. Why did we go all the way down? We didn't have to. Hazel's being a little misbehavior. A <laughs> surprise. Had the same experience as Jinzy. Basically got that collector's edition sitting around for ages. I, I... Here, listen. Ta-da! <laughs> Do you know how upsetting it is to have that staring in the face and not play it? <laughs> Do you know? Do we know? And I did set him up. He's, uh, can you see him? It, it's Johnny right there next to Regis, next to my Majora's mask. <laughs> like Rogue is trying to redeem herself with Johnny. I think they're both trying to redeem themselves. Well, yes, actually I do. <laughs> I know exactly what that feels like. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Oh, there's no one else to kill here? That doesn't seem realistic. Okay. Well, there's one person here. Do you want to die? Open fire! Oh, okay. I was going to be sneaky about it, but I guess not anymore. I insaluted them as well. Fantastic. We're not in combat. Oh, are we? 
I feel like people are interested in us, but... Heads down! Probably a control turn nearby. Jinzy, stop looting. Stop looting. It's so unnecessary. You don't need to loot. Oh, it's this. The Valor mission. Back to square mun. One. What is that? Oh, that's a long. They automated away people to kill in the future. Fair enough. You care about the bucks? Is the world the game? The story is just a gem for me. I <clears throat> when when I saw how bad it was for people, and I, the fact that I wanted to stream it, I already knew that crashes specifically were going to make the streaming experience terrible. I think if I was playing it solo, if I wasn't streaming it, it wouldn't it wouldn't have bothered me that much. But when you're streaming and it crashes, it, it, it becomes kind of a menace. What murder? Cool, Steve. Welcome back. Someone called for a backstabbing hamster. E oh, your boo. In my party? Let's go. We do Phantom City after this, or does the story end? I already did the Phantom Liberty. We finished that one on uh, Thursday. Welcome back, Coolsty. Thank you so much for the tier 3 resub. Hello. Do you wonder how the multiplayer plans would have worked out? There's Snake! <laughs> PS4 version on launch didn't even get to gameplay half the time. Yeah, and I heard that that's because it wasn't... It, they'd already done too much. It was fine on PlayStation 5, but PlayStation 4 just couldn't handle it. Phantom DLC takes place before the game's ending in terms of timeline. See, so it makes sense. It only makes sense. Secure your soul! Oh, are these the listeds? They are. All the people that they have soul secured. Open. Patching in old. Let your woman up. Oh! Flamez, you cannot be here. <laughs> you cannot be here. We are playing the end mission of Cyberpunk. Avert your eyes. Flamez. Thank you so much for the Raid, welcome in, hi. Each year, listen. It's the last day, maybe, potentially. It could be, anyway. <laughs> do, 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 do. I, Flamez is also playing Cyberpunk, but he, he is very, very early on in the game. He is not anywhere close to the end. And I don't want to spoil it for you, but you should follow him if you want to see somebody else play Cyberpunk or Final Fantasy XIV or if you just want to vibe with somebody who uh, is very cool. In general? Just in general. <laughs> Welcome in Flamez. You're like, I'm only on the second mission. You are very early, very early on. But you do the same thing I do, which is go everywhere and do everything and see everything and just like mess around. So I get it. You'll be here for months. <laughs> but I am on, I'm literally on the final mission. So you're going to have to gonna have to leave but then i'll be done with cyberpunk maybe free god kill everything oh yeah no i did that too <laughs> bye flames thank you for the raid love you bye okay i'm gonna press escape now you ready you ready are you gone are you ready are you gone okay out of her box let her show us what she's got let okay, your woman out of her box know that I do. Just a shame you never did. Oh! Ouch. Painful. Very painful. True, but very painful. Either way. Well, could have been worse. Alt in. Think she can break through the ice? I will find security. The answer is yes. Oh! Oh! You were the guy we were still in combat with! Stop it. <laughs> Sorry, Alt, it made a noise. I know you were probably fine, but it made a noise. Approaching the landing platform. Cavalry's come to the rescue. 
Yeah, but aren't they gonna... Yeah, that. I was gonna say. Aren't they that? Yo! <laughs> oh! Do you minx? <laughs> She's doing such a good job. Look at all that murder! I don't know. Rope, rope, you're cute, but like that's kind of a vibe. That's kind of a vibe. <laughs> you kind of love it. Drones love to sing little songs of murder. They do that when they notice you. After this, Stellar Blade? Stellar Blade? Fuck me. I know. She's so violent. She's literally burning through their faces. How is your face doing? Badly? Thought as much. Oh, you're already here. What are you, uh, what are you reading? Netrun operations control. What are you reading? Are those phone eyes? Are you wearing phone eyes right now? Most effective all fire in gaming history. It's a lot. Hi, Kirlian. Oh my god. Bullshit. Saka propaganda in the elevator? Got something on your mind? Ever think back about why we did it? Did what? Why we took, took on the corpse, strapped in leather, chrome, and iron. Because we looked hot doing it? Dunno, Johnny. We were young. Hot blood in our veins, shit judgment in our heads, like all pups. Oh, we still do. We fought for beauty. We Not still do. <laughs> what was good or true. It was only the beautiful that meant a damn thing to us. Don't let your mind wander. We'll kick around old brain cells over vodka once we're done. My treat, eh? Or people with stories of the old and days. Just like my grandparents. <laughs> Our soccer netrunners have stormed the tower's systems. Well, they've certainly Stop tried. Their advance is my priority. Continue on your way alone. Okay, I have swords. I've cleared a path, but you must hurry. An elite security unit Made a run for you. it? Wound up turret fodder. Holy fucking Christmas. Who is she? Holy fucking Christmas. A woman pushed to the very... Oh, shit. Seems Cunningham's made strides these last decades. Murder strides? Wow. Who are we fighting? I don't think we're fighting anybody. I'm a good shower, Marshall. Wish my eyes could do that. They look so... Honestly, I love how the phone eyes look. The phone eyes look... They look kind of hot. <laughs> kind of love it, actually. There's a lot of toothless dancing today. A lot of it. It's just one of those days. Taking a moment for Chinese food? Am I the final she boss of my game? Good luck Come and on. have fun. Way down's beyond the door. Rogue, are you scared? Are you scared, Rogue? Are you scared? Rogue, are you scared? Rogue. Looks like our work here is already done. I don't get to kill anybody! You've said that before. Again, you keep saying that. Let's oh my it. god, it's gonna be Smasher! Isn't it gonna be Smasher? It has to be. It's gotta be Smasher. Are we gonna smash okay. Smasher? So close, I can almost smell the data stream. Smash Otter. We cross it and we're at the core. How worried are we? Oh, Wayland, I feel like you should uh, walk faster. Can't turn back time, Johnny. Ever. But you can always start over. Ooh! Ooh! Fuck the meat guy! Ooh! Ooh! No! 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 What the fuck? I'm not okay. I'm not okay. There will be nothing left. Wait, can he also die? Like, is he gonna die? 
You better not. You better not. You be no, just no, no. If you have to go for anybody, you're going for me. See it again. Jesus Christ! <laughs> he just absolutely. She deserved better than that. She deserves so much better than that. What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh, but like, okay, okay so but I, okay. Oh God, I have to see it again. I don't wanna! Room past the partition. We cross it and we're at the core. <sighs> Can't turn back time, Johnny. Ever. But you can. I'm gonna always... see every. Or I'm gonna wanna see every single type of ending. And people say I'm Edge Runner was emotionally damaging? That was the worst one! That was the worst one. They made it more challenging? I'm playing on very hard mode as well. Genuinely though, oh. you can try, but you can try. Well, maybe I should shoot him with the gun. Maybe that's what he deserves. No, I'm still not done. Fuck you. Where did he go? Where the fuck did he go? Are you running away from me, you little bitch? What the fuck? No there you are. Oh, now that now you got friends? Well, I'm uh, literally mad about it. Fucko, you absolute fucko. You think I don't get more berserks? I'm gonna berserk so fucking hard. Don't be a coward! Don't be a coward, you shit! I am trying to face you! You keep running away like a bitch! Where are you? There you are. I still have my second heart, you little shit! Do we have more people? Oh no, you're Wayland. Where are you again? Oh my god! I wanna slap your foot! I am struggling, but I'm gonna win too! You're literally in pieces! Oh god, I hope it hurts. You're at 5%, buddy. You're on the floor. Go fuck yourself. Fuck you. The path to the corner lies open, but we don't have much time. Pick up Robe's gun. Decide items to ma- Listen to me, you poor oh, son I of a bitch. Want to take out my gun? More than you or I ever could. Best, Best there ever was. And, and you killed her. She knew the risks. Shut the fuck up! I'm gonna mute things. Rogue had it in for you. Finally got what she wanted. You're talking tribe. I killed the old cunt. Don't know shit, Smasher. She finished things off on her own terms. Something you'll never. Yeah, fucko. Wait. Okay, I'm already wearing the gun. Good. Fuck you. Optional. 
That's his whole arm. Rogue. Fuck that guy. You were the best. Always. generation made of a different metal no it's true wait huh? judgment tarot i missed a tarot i'm missing another one shut up there's tarot cards in here <coughs> you didn't expect wayland to survive can he die here serious question in this fight you should- you should run away now. I don't want you to die, either. We have to put them in a boss area, apparently. Wayland, buddy. You should go. Hey, Wayland. Yeah, ma'am. You're alright. Good luck, Silverman. You cannot save him? Why would you not save him? He knows. He says Silverman. You should do the third not well-known character doesn't make it out of the big cinematic boss fight. No, it's only the the important one that died. Link to it. Insert yourself. Then search for me on the other side. Also your own. As for me, I'm sorry. The hell? Change? Wait, huh? What? Where the fuck? <gasps> nibbles! Nibbles! Hi, hey, Nibbles! Why are you not in my apartment? Oh, another Nibbles! Okay, this is. I don't think it's Nibbles anymore. Oh, it's the same roof again. Pick up the necklace? Is that Johnny's necklace? Or is it... No, it's mine. It's the one Misty gave me. The bullet in my head. Oh. Once out of nature, I shall never take my bodily form from any natural thing. Well, this is a but little trippy. A form as Grecian goldsmiths make, of hammered gold and gold enameling, to keep a drowsy emperor awake, or set upon a golden bough to sing to lords and ladies of Byzantium of what is past or passing or to come. Uh. Huh? If this is heaven, it's kind of messed up. I don't think I want to go there anymore.
need somebody to sort of witness here. Like they feel transparently why Wayland is there from a narrative perspective. It's an anticipation of Rogue dying. But he can also not be there, apparently. He, it's, it's possible for him to not be there. Is your soul secure? Who knows? Other cats? I mean, maybe it was Nibbles. Matrix deja vu joke with the cats? Whoa. Deja vu. Does that mean I'm about to get attacked? This actually does have a... There's one picture I know somebody drew of a Lovecraftian scene and this kind of reminds me of that. It's not a good thing. No, Rose Chief, this is what my life always looks like. Wait. It's me. Hey, V. Hey, V. Happy to see me? My character looks dead-eyed. Straight up. Exactly. Blacked out, then woke up here. I miss anything? They decided on the eyes, and the eyes are something... I, I'm sorry. I, but the eyes? This is how the eyes look all of the time on your character. <laughs> is it just because she's having a, a really, really bad trip right now? Hi, Shad. Hello. My V looks gorgeous. Rogue's gone. Rogue's dead. Smasher was there. I'm sorry. Shouldn't be. Died for me, not for you. Well, a little bit of both. Is my body still in one piece? I'm glad I switched my outfit. Parked in Arasaka Tower's basement, plugged it into the network. I figured as much. Your output's been torching my brain with Soul Killer for a good while now. Huh. You'll be all right? You'll be all right. I mean, look, you made it this far. Awareness of what's happening right now? That just <laughs> raunches. Like, Alt neatly packed me into an engram. Couldn't even tell when. Or how. So what do you think? Like being a clump of ones and zeros? It's not great. At first, the phantom pain. Jesus. I felt like my whole body was on fire. Realize now, it's not pain at all, just some digital simulacrum. Guess all it's gonna start moving this digital psyche I am back into my flesh, but I had no idea if I'll survive or what I'll be if I do. Oh, why can't we feel it working? Soul killer, we can't feel it doing its thing. How come? Should be pissing our panties in pain right now. Digital analgesia. Or data streams. Certain sensation inputs can be blocked. Blah, blah, yada, yada. Alt, make you suffer through an exhaustive <laughs> lecture. Imparted it instantly. Whatever. She did say she'd destroy Makoshi. Just as you agreed. Gonna release all those poor bastards only to suck them into her own bosom. Make them part of herself. Yeah, that's what I figured she was gonna do. So we at the finish line? It's all in Alt's hands now. No. What the hell? Alt? I made a mistake in excluding the body as a factor. Of course. DNA reconfiguration has progressed too far. Added to aggressive, invasive medications, the body's immune system attacking its own neurons. Spit it out! In human terms! V will die independent of what I do. This is inevitable. This is imminent. What? Check again. If V's engram is damaged, can't you fix her? Hardware. Therein lies the problem. The organism's neurons have been dying for a time. Any attempt at a procedure upon its brain would result in the latter. I knew I was drinking You're a too much. Genius. Think of something. Enough. Johnny, shut up. I need to think. You're gonna be all right. I said, give me it's one so fucking minute. It's so funny that I literally am not in control of my own character right now. My character's mad about it. Oh, come on. There's got to be a way out of this. The biochip has irreversibly changed the host organism. It no longer belongs to V, who is an intruder there. The situation is different for you. All changes were made to accommodate you. Hang on. Telling your ex to kick me out of my own body? 
The changes are irreversible. You have nothing left to lose. He has everything to gain. I will not interfere in your personal affairs, but while Johnny has full control, he can do what he wishes. Wait. Actually? Alt, give us a what the hell for? So you could trick me into agreeing. I'm giving you a free pass, even though you can already do what you want with my body. <gasps> I can say you're my friend. You're my friend, Lee. I'd never pull that on you. Never do you wrong. Seeing is how I'm doomed to die. We stick to the plan I gave you. I leave, I you stay. <laughs> Keys to my body are yours. Why? You can actually put him in my body. But won't this- like, she said that the body's gonna die anyway. No. It's gonna be me. You lying sack of shit. So what do I do, Walt? What do you mean lying? Once we cross the bridge. You will become a part of me, as V's body and former life are restored. Why do you mean lying? Enter the well to return to V's body. Optional. Cross the bridge and enter cyberspace forever. That's the deal we made. Why did my character say we're lying? It's not a lie. Enter the well, though? Is this not the well? What's the well? I straight up do not know what the well is. I'm assuming this will let me enter cyberspace forever, though. Because that's what I want to do. Johnny. That's what I want to do. What? That's what I want to do. That Are you fucking kidding me? Think too big a dose of Silverhand wound up in my blood. Need to chill. Listen, if I had to choose who to hole up with on a desert island, it wouldn't be you. Ever. Hell, the whole cast of Little Big Corpo Rats would have me be. Because <laughs> you're a dickhead. In a big way. And sure, plenty of others out there are more deserving of life. But even so, I never wish you dead. I'm gonna die, V. Just promise me one thing, asshole. You won't forget me. I have a real question. Uh, that is a real question. This is the way to cross the bridge and, and enter cyberspace, right? I'm not go- because I don't want to return to V's body. I don't know what the well would look like. Okay, like it is. Okay, that's because that's the decision I want to make. Cross bridge with. Okay, so they actually tell you. I was worried for a second. <laughs> Johnny said, "When the time comes, I will leave." Now what? Oh, it's my own apartment again. Judy! Ma. 
morning. Hi, babe. Morning. Morning, you. Gonna hop in the shower. Mm hmm. Me too. So is Johnny gone? Oh, it's my last fancy apartment. This feels kind of weird. <laughs> Why are we being normal about it? Are you weird normal? Oh, am I still dying? Jesus Christ. Nothing. Just dying. Okay. Oh, we got that on again? You need me. I'll be in the kitchen. <laughs> that was the fastest shower I've ever seen in my entire life. Am I still dying? I mean, Alt did kind of say that would happen. It was kind of weird about that, though. Get dressed? Can I just... No? I actually have to go and get dressed. Did I get dressed? It doesn't seem like I did. Do I have to wear my sp the specific outfit? Aviators? V's golden aviators? Oh my god, V. This is what you chose to wear? V, why? <laughs> Alright, I'm not reading chat right now specifically because I, I just have to be a little bit more careful. <laughs> I'm sure you understand. We will talk after. Hey, babe. All right, V. What's wrong? Feeling worse? I don't know if I'm dying or not. You know what's wrong. I'm am I? I think you know what's wrong. Am I still? Dying, Judy. Rather not talk about it just now. It's all Makoshi, isn't it? Saw your new meds in the bathroom. It's getting worse, right? Yeah, don't worry, don't worry. Don't worry, we'll all, don't worry. We'll all work out soon. Work out. V, I'm not blind or stupid. I can see the wall you've put up. You're not letting me pass. Uh, sometimes I get the feeling you wouldn't even notice if I just up and disappear. Oh no, I'm making Judy sad. Anyway, I'll be outside. Maybe I'll catch a glimpse of the Crystal Palace. Okay, but making Judy sad is not... That's not okay. We're not okay. I'm not okay. With that. You know? Guess you could mistake it for Venus. V? I think I messed up. We're not talking about the Crystal Palace anymore. Are we? It's weird as hell, but I think I might have just realized I never felt right here. Used to think I actually liked being one atom among many, anonymous and safe, but it was an illusion. I look at this city and feel lost, like a lost atom <laughs> sometimes, but mostly. I feel alone. See, you have me already doesn't work here, does it? Because I... I know the feeling. Apparently I'm Did not... go away? I'm not no. helping. Never. You know, I used to keep time in phases. From one juncture to another. The mega building hole in the wall phase. <laughs> the home. The gang. The mox phase. 
Each and every time, I thought I'd found a home. And each and every time, I came away disappointed. What phase is this? What would you call this phase? What I wanted to talk to you about. Oh actually. god, she's breaking up with me. Listen, V. I, I gotta get out of here. Ditch Night City, find something better, something more solid. You understand? Yeah, can I come with you? <laughs> good idea. Ought to leave as fast as you can. But I'm dying, so... Got nothing good that awaits you here. Especially since I'll soon... I, I understand. I really do. What about you? I'm gonna die, yeah. apparently. Still got some biz. I thought for some reason you. that we would find oh. a way to fix it. So it is biz. Is that thing at the afterlife? I don't know why I thought that. The job. Still got something to prove to the city? No. Wherever you go won't let you forget me. Ooh. If it works, I won't let you forget. You're gonna hear about me. Wherever you end up. <laughs> These postcards from the edge. <laughs> I like the idea. I'll be waiting for them. Oh, that's my car? Better get going. My car. Oh, I know. Take care of yourself, V. And come back in one piece. You take care, too. I feel like I'm getting just a terrible ending. Watch out for yourself out there, V. Does the jacket also look tacky as hell? Oh, huh. Yeah. Yeah. Yes and no. I don't know what the hell this outfit is. <laughs> My collection. Are you sure I can't change my outfit? Because I look terrible. <laughs> I look really bad. Can we go without pants? Yeah. <laughs> I look really bad. Ice, hello. Hey, right, alerts are off, so I didn't see you come in. Okay, well, oh wait. This is not the car I'm supposed to go with? It is. I'm just gonna have to wear the weird pants. Even though I had a really, really good-, good morning, V. Del! Zip off to today. <laughs> Hi, Del. The afterlife. Head over there. Absolutely. We'll be taking those special air corridors. Excited as I am. I don't know, am I? So we should make good time. <laughs> awesome. Making Are me face this in like this outfit? Hard night. Difficult mm. few weeks. Golly, I'm sorry to hear that. Your incursion into Arasaka Tower has given you all respect, unlimited resources. Now for physical ailments. Has it actually? If it helps, I can offer additional services and spa treatments and whatnot. That may be just the thing for your current condition. It's really not, In fact, though. I've teamed up with Trauma Team to provide a medical care package. Limited time offer. Safe travels, I call it. You could try it now. What do you say? A little too late for medical help? As to any medical aid. Oh. Be late and any short for that. I'm afraid I don't understand. But you've unlimited resources at your disposal. I'm certain we can find something appropriate and thoroughly satisfying. Oh, buddy. Don't worry about he it. He doesn't understand. Have it your way. Night City does look a lot better from the top, doesn't it? How's the sitch in the city? Arasaka's in a right pickle. An organizational shambles. Its share price is tanked. Public mistrust is at an all-time high. I could go on. Good. Secure Your Soul was to be a mammoth success for Arasaka. It turned into a mammoth curse. Good. Fuck you, Arasaka. Mm -hmm. Promised the rich immortality. Sold them on it. Actually collected engrams and knowledge. A bid for control. For power, I say. And the street? What's the street saying? The street's saying I literally have an ad running soon. 
I've paused it three times. I don't want you to miss anything, so I don't want to be rude. Did you let Johnny take over? I did. I did. So I let Johnny take over. I attacked. Rogue died. Um, Wayland lived. And then I took my body back. Or rather, Johnny's, I guess, gave up my body. But I have to do a break because otherwise it'll literally run straight through this last cutscene, presumably. I actually didn't expect me the, the game to be, I guess, short. Yeah, Johnny take over the mission and then he sacked himself for V. Yeah, I'm a little curious what it would work out like if you do take over the body. What was your Phantom Liberty decision? I'll let you know in a minute. I'll be right back. Okay, hi. Hello. It's uh, I think it's a coke day. <laughs> You're welcome, Max. Yes, I did cross the bridge to go with Ultra Cyberspace. Or rather, Johnny did. So, Johnny is with Alt now and gave me back my body. I'm giving these beautiful ads to support a fantastic stream. Thank you. So, for Phantom Liberty, I shot Reed, I let Songbird go into space, and uh, that's, it, that's it, I think. Those are the biggest decisions, I think, that I made. I think that's it. I think that's it. Rumors about, naturally. You're onto something huge with someone even huger backing you. 
their resources yet more huge. <sighs> Nothing much besides. You went with Judy as well? I don't remember. Was, was there anything about that in the DLC? Was there? Did that too? Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. So Bonsai was specifically asking about the DLC decision that I made. I got a fried chicken that incredible. Arasaka's a mess, trying to rein in the chaos. At any rate, you, the afterlife, you're safe. For some time, anyway. Cream. Just cream. I really want to see the endings with Johnny as well. Hi, Alexander. Hello. That's because you took the lone gun ending, whereas I took a different one? The lone gun ending? As in... Have a nice day. As in, like, you didn't do, uh, you didn't let Johnny take over to do the rogue thing? Or, how do you mean? Have a nice day, Dee. Thanks, Del. You're so cute. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go inside. I don't think you are. Several! I did them! It was me. I did the murder. The moon? Oh my god. At the Crystal Palace? I'm the boss now? Hey, we good? Perfect. Your box is ready and waiting. How did that happen? <laughs> Hi, Claire. Wait, hi, Claire. Hi, Claire. Get you something? The usual. My usual. What's my usual? Sure thing. I want to know what my usual is. Something's up. Won't be able to keep it under wraps much longer. Won't have to. Take off today. Today? Is that a problem? No, no. Just in that case, you're going to need something special. Rogue had this little ritual. Before any big op, she'd knock back a shot of tequila. Silverhand's preferred. Of course. Asked her once if it was for luck or whatever. Know what she said? Said it was about remembering. Said that remembering Johnny that way helped her focus on what was important. That's cute. Anyways, afterlife tradition. Gonna mix you up one of our specials. Just tell me who we're drinking to. Okay, this is gonna... Okay, no, I feel like I should drink... Oh, oh no! Ah, I want to drink to everyone. This is so, going to sound so mean. I don't care about Jackie at, at, at all. Okay, not at all, but I barely, I barely care about Jackie. But I care a lot about Johnny. I think I'm going to drink to Johnny. Well, but it's Rogue's place. I feel like I, I, sh so, I, I should drink to, to Rogue because, because, ah. <laughs> so me not to but also Johnny gave himself up I feel but even though I made the decision it's still I'm gonna drink to John that makes me drink to Johnny. Johnny. Drink into Johnny. that way I'm also honoring I mean, Rogue I only know what people say about a him, little Betty because because uh, Rogue Shit, drank to him too I know so we're drinking Good together luck, to the same person it, 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 it works okay I'm leaving Hey, boss. Hey. Hi, you're still alive. Looking brand new. Put you back together beautifully. Brand shiny new way of <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, somehow. Anyway, I had an upper sitting on my ass in the clinic. Feel much better here. Where you can tell everyone about your Sokka Tower heroics? Yes. <laughs> you know it. But what you plan <laughs> to do today? I mean, respect. Nothing else will ever come close. I don't know what Take I'm gonna do, so. Care yourself. Who knows? And good luck. Thank you. Thanks. Can I pet Nibbles? No? I should be allowed to pet every cat I find. V. I yeah, exactly. Exactly. To look the latest afterlife legend in the eye. Mr. Blue Eyes. I must say, I moved. Happy not to You were the contact. Ladies first. Suspicious. Talk to me. Well, V. Mikoshi was quite the punch. You TKO'd Arasaka, in fact. Brought you eddies. 
influence around town. Everyone died. But not just that. I it off. meant positive yeah, paralysis sorry. of Arasaka systems. A few additional hatches opened up. My people rushed in, grabbed what they could. So it's all systems go for the up. I have confirmed the intel leaking out of Arasaka. The casino is currently testing a new security system. And it's true. They will be shutting it down briefly today. I believe you'll know how to use... Am I going to upload myself into the net as well? I'm the best. Won't be disappointed. I'm the best. Pick the best merc around for the job. So I've heard. But I'd like it proved to me as well. Speaking of which, nobody's ever pulled off a stunt like Guess this. Guess I'm nobody. Where I'm from, they'd say it's straight impossible. Well, they're boring. They'd they have say no you're imagination. Too big a risk. Poetically speaking, flying towards the sun to burn up. Maybe that's the goal. What do you know? They'd be all kinds of wrong. It's why you hired me. Guess that's why you hired me. <laughs> hey. <laughs> you know why I hired you? Because you do anything at all for even the faintest. I can shoot you in the survival. face right now, and I would. Even if it meant coming to within a hair's breadth of your untimely death. This time tomorrow should have the casino's client data, all of it. Don't forget your side of the bargain. Oh, I never forget a promise. I'm going to Good space. Luck. I'm going to the Crystal Palace. <laughs> Is that a good idea? Oh, I'm in space. I'm actually in space. I'm gonna go to the Crystal Palace. I just still don't know why. Right. In position. Perfect. Almost to the second. My turn. Hmm. Satellites are down for now. Just got the signal. Signature cloaking activated. Remember. Got one shot and one shot only. Okay. Tell me something I don't know. I can't save, I think. As soon as it starts, there'll be no backing down. No chance at extraction. No chance of survival if anyone notices. Excellent. But if this works, you'll gain more than you ever imagined. Times when I had something to gain are long gone. Now, now I got nothing to lose. That's kind of <laughs> Yes. Then again, who am I to judge? Nobody knows a damn thing. Meeting one of two things, or maybe both. The guy swimming with great whites way above our info circle, high up enough that nobody can even give us the known unknowns, or he's shady as hell, given the city doesn't abide the nameless. Huh. Suspicious? I'm gonna infiltrate? Huh. Everything here is suspicious. Okay, I do want to get armed, please. With a space gun? Gonna use my space gun. I'm not suspicious. What do you mean? It has been Spoiler City. It's a just in case. Everyone is very excited, yes. <laughs> but it's okay, Alva does not read. We'll wait. Okay. Here goes nothing. Good luck. See you down bottom. Over and out. We're actually starting Mass Effect now. I won't say more just in case. <laughs> <Spoilers>. <laughs> oh, I just have not been able to look ne not silly. I just look silly at the entirety of the end of the game. But God, I'm so pretty though. God, I'm so pretty.
Why are we going here? Am I supposed to do- oh no, okay! <laughs> Am I supposed to do something? That was a little goofy, I'm not gonna lie. Just a little goofy. <laughs> Are we in the space station? Now? Or? Drifting into space is used to run out of air? Wait, what?! Hey, hey, what's up, kid? A while since you came to see old Vic. I'll bet your tunes in the afterlife found you a new major league ripper, huh? Huh? A swanky downtown fucker shooting chrome out his ass. Am I right? No, dude, I'm as confused uh, as you are. I mean it, kid. Get all you can out of this life. You deserve it. More than anyone I know. Victor, I'm very confused. But stop by sometime, okay? Next time you're in the neighborhood, oh, you can't. we'll talk about old times and I'll take a look at you. Move Make myself sure up that a the little. new ripper of yours didn't screw anything up. See you around, V. Here, he can still see him. Uh, hey, V. Are I'm you? Just, uh, oh, okay. I'm calling to say goodbye. I finally decided to up and leave this city for good. Yeah, Realize fuck this city, buddy. It gives you two choices. You either become an asshole. Or eventually you get off by one. Yeah. I hope you somehow find an alternative. I'm not I'm not there, I don't think. It's a shame things had to end this way. I'm in space. Judy, I'm in space. Have a nice life. V. Oh, she became an asshole. Hello, V. How are things? Weather in the Badlands is pleasant as usual. My cooler melted, it's 90 degrees in the shade, and there's sandstorms heading straight for us. So yeah, you're missing out. No, but seriously, we're doing all right. Saul and I somehow get along, for better or for worse. But still, family's always growing, work's always piling up. But better to keep busy, right? Everyone seems a little I sad. Think if it wasn't for you, I'd still be stumbling my way through nights. Yeah, that would suck. So I just want to say thank you. For all you've done for me. I'd still be lost if you hadn't set me on the right track. Alright, well. Talk soon, V. Don't be a stranger. Nah, we're friends now. Oh, well, v, and you're uh, also so calling me. <laughs> okay. Heard about something big happening in Night City, with a certain V in the lead role. Yeah, I killed a bunch of people again. Uh, don't know what you plan to do now, but just remember, we always take care of our own. And um, you're one of us now, V. <laughs> you're an Aldo Caldo. Remember that. No more Bucker. Sorry, Backer. Uh, take care Both? of yourself, V, and see you around. I mean hey, can you hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Again, all the Elder Caldos. Okay. In quick well, succession. All of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by. Mitch, I'm in space, I think. Get a barbecue going. Knock a few back. Do a couple of races. Or pay a friendly visit to the Raff and Shiv. Guess what I'm trying to say? Is, <laughs> well, Badlands could use a badass like you. It's be. true. I did kill a lot of people. Don't know what you got on your plate right now. But remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now take care. Hi, Mitch. Hi, hey, Carrie. Hey, so, funny thing just said. Oh, fuck, fuck, shit. Voicemail. Oh, <laughs> Carrie. Do you ever answer the phone? I'm in like space, ever? Carrie. Seriously, I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. <laughs> what did I even. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that. Relatable. Cracks agent and asked if I would go on tour with them. Are you? At first, I was like, over my dead fucking body. But then I thought, hey, wait. 
could actually be fun. So, uh, who knows? Uh, well, there's <laughs> the latest gossip for you, if you, if you can. I Call like Carrie, can, yeah. all right? I know a lot of y'all don't. I like Carrie. I think he's great. Hey, hey. So, Hi, River. A couple fellas from the 5th Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron. Sawed offs, okay. stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought, maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff for a good cause. I still remember what you did for us, for me and Randy. This city needs more people like you. And I'm gonna make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. Bye, River. Sorry we didn't fuck. I think. Before oh! Are you about to seppuku? A death boy. Because I, uh, you know, final thoughts about life. Didn't go with the lady. About death. I have read many of them of late. Some are truly works of beauty. Yet I am not a samurai. He's gonna so seppuku. I you farewell with simple words. Rot in hell. Kusana. Listen, I had shit going on. I'll do your ending eventually. Hey, it's oh, hey, it's him. You're gonna want to hear this. Okay. But first, we need to go somewhere. No one's listening. I'm in space, so that's that's okay. pretty far away. So my wife, Elizabeth, she's in on the whole thing. She she keeps saying I should look after myself. Tells me to take these pills. Says they're vitamins. Got them analyzed at a lab, and they look okay. But, but how am I supposed to know if something? Oh God, he became hell a paranoid. Oh, 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 you got a sec? Call me, okay? Oh, oh yeah, and don't forget to delete this message. Oh God, he is so paranoid now. This poor man. I don't think he had a good ending. Hi, hey, Misty. Hey. Well, listen, I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot. What does it say about I space? Know the reading's not as strong without you here. Because I'm in space? We haven't seen each other for so long, and I... Well, one thing led to another. Know what I drew? Strength, the Emperor, and the world. Zavaruro. The world's gonna hear about you. Oh, it's probably because I'm in Go space. Go and show Night City what you're I making. can't. I'm literally in space. See? That sounds like space. Oh, yeah. Was that everyone? Was that everyone? Oh. Okay. We had to fade well, I guess that's the end. <laughs> I finished the game. I'm very confused. <laughs> we went off the deep end. He did. Love the Jefferson call. Great callback. I'm so glad we just got another glimpse into that whole thing. I feel bad for him. Because I, I don't think he's okay. Undrew the world. We're in space. I don't finish my run. Or did I, did you just see the ending and not actually play? Did you save before the Johnny uh, Joyce? I saved a few times. I don't know that I did it just before the Johnny Joyce though. Everyone you unlocked and is still alive. Oh God! <laughs> is it because I killed so many people? This ending is confusing for a first playthrough. It was very lore heavy. The voicemail is partly why I changed my mind of telling him or not. Maybe mm, next time. The game starts you back just before Embrace after each ending. Really? That's kind of nice. He chose the same ending? I feel... Oh, okay, hold on. Hey, you can vibe check again. <laughs> I unmuted the alerts. Can play them back to back too. I don't think I will. See, I don't think I will. I don't think I want to play them all back to back. I am very curious what will happen. But I feel like I want to do a whole new playthrough at some points. Actually do a whole new playthrough. There's a few people I didn't hear of though. Like, I kind of thought I would hear about the Cyber Psychos. Because I did such a... I did such a good job keeping every cyber psycho alive. I thought Regina would say something about it. 
game got really close to being a core memory for me, but it falls short just barely. Oh, your actual ending choice was different from mine. So nice to see someone else. Really? Did you like your ending? I have no idea. You know that? I actually have no idea. I don't know what I expected. I feel like, okay, people who have played the tabletop game, I have a real question. Is this game more enjoyable if you are aware of lore in the tabletop game? Need to make friends with Johnny for one, so that might be a new playthrough thing? Am I not friends with Johnny? I feel like I'm friends with Johnny. I can literally, I literally got, as Johnny, I got to say, you're my friend. It's literally what he said. I feel like I'm friends with him. Yeah, with different builds. Yeah, exactly. I want. I really want to do a, a Netrunner one. My favorite is the Pan Am one. Really? Hi, Seedling. Hello. The Pan Am one kind of surprised me that it was an option. I did the DLC ending weave into the main game ending. It didn't seem to, to me. I think the same final mission approach as you, though, with Johnny. Not at all of this playthrough way. Is there supposed to be a playthrough where it is? Tenno, thank you so much for the gift sub. Welcome in, Steedling. Enjoy your emotes. Very much so. Doubt it, very much so. Not really. I feel like a lot of it was very, if you already knew the lore, then you would understand. Like the, the Bartmoss thing where they were like, oh, wow, it's Bartmoss. And I was like, who? <laughs> Yeah, she got to kill herself as Johnny. Yes, exactly. Just a high friendship choice. Yeah, so I was good friends. Somewhat more enjoyable. There are a few fun references, but not many. Okay, my favorite ending is the Panam ending also. Panam one here too. There's a lot of Panam here in the chats. You wait for a few seconds when picking uh, to storm Saka Tower with Roger or Panam. It'll pop up if you meet the requirements. When picking to storm with Rogue or Panam. So like on the rooftop? Or are we okay discussing how the DLC can affect the main game ending? Uh, yeah, you can tell me. Knowing greater game lore can potentially deepen your understanding, but I wouldn't say it's necessary. See, because here's the thing. I'm a, I'm a huge Witcher fan. <laughs> Surprise, I'm a huge Witcher fan. And I always tell people, you can enjoy the Witcher games fully without ever reading the books. You can, absolutely you can. But the fact that I did read the books and I am very, very invested in the books made me love the games. Not enjoy, but love the games. And yeah, you didn't need to read the books. You didn't need to read the lore. You didn't need to know any of that to play the games, enjoy the games and understand the games. But it added so much for me. The fact that I knew about the lodge, the fact that I knew Regis, the fact that I knew about vampires and how they worked, the fact that I knew about the, the North and their Kings, the fact that I knew about the state of the world. It added a lot to my playthrough, to my understanding of the story, to why things matter and my investment in the characters. And I'm wondering that even if you say that it doesn't really matter, if it would work the same for cyberpunk. Because I did tune out a few times where I was like, I have no idea what you're talking about right now. Knowing greater game work can potentially deepen your understanding, but I wouldn't say it's necessary. Yeah, but that's so, so what I just said, Core, would you say that that's interesting to me? Uh, Mr. Blue Hands, if you don't know much about him, this ending really does not have much weight. Oh, so he is a character from lore. It's not a high friendship choice. It's wholly dependent on one dialogue option, which we didn't pick. Really? Okay. Yeah, you can you can talk about that. I don't mind. I don't mind because when I replay this game, it will be far, far, far into the future. I will not be replaying this game anytime soon. Hi, Danny. Hi, Sin. You crab dancing on Johnny's demise. <laughs> Damn, Sin. <laughs> what the hell? Thank you so much, Sin. <laughs> 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 
just randomly coming in here with some crafts? Thank you so much. What the fuck? <laughs> That's very generous of you. I dance on the dead. Are you literally dancing on his grave? Thank you. Bam! I appreciate it very much. <laughs> Thank you so much. Happy crab dancing. But yeah, you joined during the credits, Danny. I uh, I didn't expect it to be as short. Well, short. Problem is that the source material is predominantly game books and they don't make for very good reading material. I guess uh, maybe if I just have a few tabletop playthroughs? I went down the lore rabbit hole and it's a patchwork of stories with a lot left to fill in, which works for tabletop as everyone creates their own version of the cyberpunk world. Yeah, that makes sense, actually. I'd still be interested, though. I would have loved if you watched Edge Runner before ending just to come to the same realization I did afterwards, but there's still time. I don't think I'm going to watch Edge Runner, though. Like, I'm not invested in Edge Runner either, and I think maybe that's, again, partially because I don't know the lore. I don't care about the lore. I don't care about your lore, which is very strange for me to say because I usually do. I think I was about five minutes on the rooftop without answering. Found this out as I went to pee. Uh oh. <laughs> the DLC can affect the main game, but it requires certain choices. This ending is kind of confusing. It is very confusing. I think that the TTRPG takes place at a significantly different time, takes away from it a bit. Oh, is it that much of a difference, really? Got so much more on my second run. Yeah, so so my plan for the second run would be to get invested in the lore a little bit. And then play Netrunner and like... Do completely different things, basically. For the DLC, I imagine you have to know about the anime. Is it that closely connected? Really? I didn't realize. I thought when people said that it wasn't really, so I, I kind of skipped on it. I spent years playing tabletop with the lore geek GM, so I really enjoyed seeing how they extrapolated stuff from 2020. Yeah, that's kind of what I want. That's that's what I want for my playthrough. So what's the deal to unlock Don't Fear the Reaper then? I don't know. What are we playing next? No, we're playing... Uh, we're playing... Where are you? A Plague Tale Requiem next. Sing comes in with the crabs! <laughs> I would agree with your assessment of Witcher and that's that it's similar to Cyberpunk. I looked up backgrounds for important characters like Johnny, Saburo, and some mercs. I'm a lore hand though. Yeah, so I think I want to do that. I do think I want to do that before I play again. Because I feel like I... So I really enjoyed this game. First of all, don't want to have that unset. I really enjoyed this game. I really enjoyed the gameplay a lot. I thought the characters were fun. But yeah, a lot of the times people would... do They would lore speak at me. And I would think, okay, I guess. <laughs> I don't like thinking that. I don't like thinking, okay, I guess. And it's very funny because this is basically... I, the, I have a, a direct comparison for it because the first ever Witcher game was that I played, the first ever Witcher anything that I came into contact with, with was a pirated version of The Witcher 2. And I really enjoyed the characters and I really enjoyed the, uh, the, the story, the world, everything. But I was really confused because The Witcher 2 especially leans very heavily on your knowledge of specifically the Lodge of Sorceresses. And I had no idea what that even was. So I played The Witcher 2, I loved it to death, and then I wanted to do more. And afterwards, I came back to The Witcher 2, having read the books, having played The Witcher 1, and... I loved it even more. It did so much more for me, immediately. Because I, I, I didn't check out when people talked to me. I didn't I didn't go, uh-huh, yeah, mm-hmm, uh-huh, uh-huh, that's nice. You have great boobs. You know, it was I was I was so invested in everything they said. So I think that's what I want my next playthrough to be. I remember the ending of this path being us in the body, not Johnny. We are in the body. We made the decision to stay in the body or give it to him. Oh, like that. I think. I think, is that when you don't choose to go with Rogue, maybe? Mr. Blue Eyes is involved in the Paralis quest and probably paid for Songbird's shuttle ticket based on her description. Yes. Yes, that, uh, that I think is confirmed, Duck. I think that, it, I think I might have found a note or something, but yes, Mr. Blue Eyes, I, I had also linked to Songbird for sure. I didn't know he was involved in the Paralis quest, but I guess that makes sense that he's a power, very powerful entity. Plague Tale 2, yes. Hi, Rainier. Hello. TTRPG has some potential lore conflicts with the game. They're not as well written as Sapkowski stuff. I feel like as long as I have more information in general, though, it should still be... Like, if I even know more about net running, Because I feel like net running was a very big deal here. 
Didn't know anything about net running. When I watched the phone calls at the credits, I saw it from the perspective of being dead, and it makes it super sad. See, I I feel like I would I would die eventually, right? Because that was already established. But I don't know why I went to space. I did the rogue ending plus Johnny keep my body, and I was very happy with the ending. Does Johnny also go to space or not? I'm going around to the cemeteries, might as well dance for enough. Hey, Dick. I was super bummed. It's actually difficult to read the lore for Cyberpunk 2077. I guess lore videos for that then, right? Penguin, did I miss you coming in? Did I? Also, I don't think I even had said hello to DJ or Valorenti. Hello. Sorry, I had to skip a lot of uh, the chat because I didn't want to risk reading spoilers. You have to tell Johnny that he did in fact screw over your relationship with him when you talk in the oil fields. And then give him the second chance and then wait before making the choice on the rooftop. Oh. I'll remember that for my second playthrough. Don't tell them to watch it or they will never watch it. Yeah, it's that, but I also did try watching Edge Runner. I, I watched the first two episodes, or the first first two or three. I think it was only the first two. Um, And I just wasn't interested at all. I feel bad saying that because people hyped it up so much. And I really did want to give it a chance, but I checked out on that one as well. And again, I, I don't know if that's just because I don't know enough about the world. I think both the game and the anime do make a few assumptions on what you might or might not know. Or might assume that you don't care, but I do care. I care very much about understanding. I think there's a difference there between me and maybe a lot of people who, who enjoy them for what they are. I... I do not like not understanding. And I am okay with theorizing. That's not like there's a difference between not understanding and things being left vague. The things being left vague, I can theorize about it, use my own knowledge about what I think happened, what I think might happen. But if uh, if I'm just confused with terminology, I just don't know what they're talking about, why they're talking about it, that I don't like. I want to know. I like knowing. I like I like immersing myself in the, the world and story a lot. And I feel like that's, I'm kind of lacking it here. That's why I want to know more. <laughs> Found a bit confusing about the ending was how some of these decisions post ending depend on what you choose to do with Makoshi. Like going with Johnny means staying in Night City. Getting help from the Aldecados means V doesn't. It's a bit odd. Like I didn't want my V to stay in Night City. Well, I went to space if that helps. <laughs> Edge Runner was a good show in itself, no lore needed. See, I didn't enjoy what I saw at all. Well, not, I, I didn't want to say at all. I think there is some good animation there, but it wasn't for me. My first playthrough, I went with the Don't Fear the Reaper ending where you storm Saka Tower just as V and Johnny. No Rogue, no Pan Am. So you're one person? Cyberpunk also isn't really about the lore. It's about your story in the here and now. For, yeah, for you. <laughs> for you. To you. <laughs> For me, I want to know the lore. It adds a lot for me. I know it doesn't for everyone. I understand fully. And I'm not saying, oh, wow, you don't care about the lore. You guys are so bad for not caring. I, I get it. Like For a lot of people, you enjoy games differently. But I, for me, story and understanding is very, very important. It, especially if it is a story-heavy game. And I slept a lot this morning, so I'm a bit behind on catching stream. I hope you slept well. And 2023 and red. Oh, my God. Mr. Blue Eyes actually can be seen in the Orbital Era final battles watching from afar? Wait, really? <laughs> Phantom Liberty has nothing to do with the anime. There was some anime references added in 1.6. Yeah, I found the trailer, which uh, I then watched the Edge Runner and realized it was literally just the opening to the show. What I'm hearing is you want to play some Cyberpunk. The TTRPG one, yeah. Kinda, I do. Cyberpunk 2020 is what the game pulls from primarily. A Cyberpunk Red set in 2045, but that one doesn't go into lore much. Gotcha. I think watching Edge Runners helped me understand the world a little. I want to understand it a lot. Big part of the fun of 2077 is seeing how little V really knows about others' motivations. <laughs> She's a little dumb. 2077 does feel it explaining the net, the NUSA, and putting the corpse into a proper context. See, I feel like. They, they leave a lot of notes in the world that you can read to get a, a better understanding. But I think that's not a good way to explain it. So I, yeah, I agree that they're not doing it well. They, I think they've tried. They try to make it so that if you are interested, you can get invested. 
I don't think this was a good way to do it. I'm, a, I'm a never really a fan of long notes. And they had a lot of long notes. So in this game, I skipped reading notes. Normally, I read all the notes. Uh, this time, it was just not going to happen. Also, because partially I knew that I probably wasn't going to understand as well as I would like to. Only Witcher I played was three. I really want to play the other Witchers. Witcher 3 was my favorite RPG of all time till Baldur's Guild 3. Really? I... So my favorite Witcher story is still Witcher 2. Uh, maybe a little bit biased, but... which I loved Witcher 2 story overall. I think I, I always make this distinction. is that the Witcher 1 has the best... Uh, the best... Oh, what's the word in English again? The best atmosphere, I guess. It has the best overall feel of being in the Witcher world. Witcher 2 is the best story. Witcher 3 is the best overall. Like, everything rolled together. I absolutely love The Witcher 2. You know, can you tell? <laughs> I found late back gamers on YouTube very informative. If you want lore, lots of videos just on lore. I kind of wanted to watch the... Uh, oh, Did she call herself the Red Queen? Well, uh, Something with Queen. On, and I don't know that she used to do a lot of cyberpunk lore. She didn't anymore. If Johnny isn't your friend because of that one choice that wasn't picked, then why would you hand over your body even with Rogan? Because he's a cutie? <laughs> you didn't use a cyber deck? I really didn't, no. And the space thing was one last job, going out in a blaze of glory? Oh, like you're making yourself like a Night City legend? That's the last one. And it doesn't really matter what you do? He does not go to space. What a guy. Just the way we're talking. Yeah, I guess in that, in that sense, it wouldn't matter if they explained what the job was. Just that it was really, really hard. Is this space thing a Phantom Liberty thing? It didn't come up. Oh, let me hide right. Sorry, I'm scrolling down slowly. I also did see Mr. Blue Eyes in the final songbird, songbird quest, like, really, really clearly than I've ever seen. Right as you start riding the train after unleashing the black wall. I don't think I caught that, but I'm going to replay and pay more attention to details. It makes much more sense for V to decide. It does, but also I kind of, I, I feel like, I guess I feel a little weird that I literally made the decision. I'm Johnny, but I'm making the decision for Johnny. I think it would have been nice if I was just V and Johnny as an NPC made the, made the decision because, so it's nice that I have the option to make the decision, but I like that Johnny had growth that he became a better person. And I would have liked if he had made, out of his own volition, if he had made the decision to let V live, to not take the body. So I haven't gone around to reading more of the Witcher books. I've only read the first two so far. I've just found the dark fantasy in the poor treatment of female characters a bit heavy. I feel like, I hear that a lot, that, uh, that people feel like the Witcher treats female characters very poorly. I don't think that's true. But I would like to hear people's thoughts on, on why they feel that way. Mr. Blue Eyes seemed to give some hope. Maybe. Maybe for our next game? Going to space is so random, yeah. When I gathered, you went there for a last chance at not dying. Probably he did you a devil's deal. Yeah, and then I wonder what the chance was. What the deal that I made was. Mr. Blue Eyes tells you, V goes to get client data on ultra-rich space casino people. Yeah, but it's very vague, right? It's, it's very vague on like the how and the why. V can't be a de facto Netrunner build in 2077 is the thing. They're called chair jocks for a reason, and Songbird's gear is like the Netrunner equivalent of Smasher's gear. So she's just better than me, is what you're saying. He doesn't go to space, he stays and does his own thing, which begins with T and ends with terrorism. <laughs> Wonderful. I only heard about it Phantom Liberty came out, so I just assumed. Wait. I think I missed something. The Confusion, the same guy who directed The Witcher 2 also directed this game, so it might explain a lot of the lore dumps from characters. Oh god! <laughs> that, yeah, honestly, maybe. Hi <laughs> Navarro, welcome in. Ever like it when someone forces me to watch, play, or do a hobby when it's forced on me? Makes it less fun or not want to do it. Same, Kaminari. Same. It's mentioned by someone earlier The Witcher has better lore and narrative due to the difference in origin. Witcher being a series of novels versus Cyberpunk being an open-ended setting for a TTRPG. I think the setting, knowing about the setting would still help a lot. In this case. I think if you just knew the setting of the Witcher world, that would also already help playing those games. Mr. Blue Eyes possibly ordered for some solution for V's condition like he did for So Me. But then the AI doesn't exist anymore, right? 
Hmm. I don't know. Hey, Sergeant. <laughs> Cyberpunk 2077 book, No Coincidence, is also a good companion to Edge Runner. It is another book from the POV of a trauma team employee, too. I feel like there's a, there's a good bit of lore written maybe after the games became more popular. Or the game, sorry. I think this ending is more about V embracing a Night City Legend role and needing to continually surpass their last job until they die spectacularly and end up on the drink menu. Yep. My most satisfying ending is asking Panam's help. And the one where I actually cried is the main game ending. Add it with the DLC. Yeah, the DLC didn't come into play for me at all. Which makes me a little sad, I guess. I thought there would be more to the DLC ending. The DLC, the DLC ending. You know what I mean? I watched the anime only having played the game and I had a blast with it. It was conclusive and didn't leave me wondering what's going on. Uh, the anime or the game? Hi, Arwen. Oh, yes. Yeah, scratch the carpet immediately. <laughs> This cat. <laughs> Usually don't like watching tragic shows versus comedic, but I'm glad I watched Edge Runners and liked it more than I thought I would. They're probably because I love the world of CP277. Yeah, I think you're already invested. It probably is more for you. I think also for me, I am definitely more a, a movie watcher as well at this point. I think I am tired of waiting for me to start enjoying something. I did make a I did make a video about this. I don't so I watched the first two episodes of Net, uh, the first two episodes of Edge Runner. It did not grab me. I don't want to wait until it does grab me. I don't have the time or the energy. There's so much I want to see. All right, Core, have a good AFK. Mr. Blue Eyes is also watching from a balcony. Really? What if I just shoot him? I thought Edge Runner adds a lot of color to the world in a way that only a TV show could. I appreciated the added flavor and color. Yeah, also because I guess it's not a <clears throat> it's not a choose your own adventure. Oh my god. You ever just talk too much? I never really got into the setting and lore, which is why I just continued watching my husband instead of doing my own playthrough. That yeah, I understand that. Couldn't tell, you could have. So wanted to see the story of the characters? Yeah. Mad Queen Show, that's the one. Yes. Her channel has been removed. Oh, she deleted her channel? Oh, then, well, then I can't watch that lore, I guess. Tactical Mr. Blue Eyes moment? Where is it? Oh, probably in the cyberpunk section, I'm gonna assume. Oh, is it in a... Is it li Oh my god. <laughs> It posted the- oh my god, it posted the entire VOD. Okay, I'll check that later. It didn't do the, the, the time skip. Rip. They did explain the job briefly. Mr. Blue Eyes wanted you to get info on clients. Yeah, but it wasn't- that's what I mean. It was very vague, right? As runners is also a fantastic way to add more emotional trauma if you need more. Yeah, I really wish I enjoyed it, but... And then we blow it up. <laughs> Imitations breed creativity, so I agree with you there. And the freedom of open world is a tricky balance. Yeah, open world in, in general, I think I have to be very careful with not burning myself out fully on that. I think if I ever play another open world that is as big as this one, I think I might do it in pieces. I don't know. Or, or I ignore every open world side thing. That's the thing. It's why I asked before what gigs were worth doing, because I do feel like I burn myself out wanting to do everything, wanting to see everything. It's very difficult for me to contain myself in that way. I don't know why. Sounds like the choice is Johnny might be gated on your relationship with Johnny. Oh yeah, no, it, it definitely would be. It definitely would be. But I just wish that I didn't have to even click the decision, if that makes sense. DLC has a similar formula to Witcher 2 with the major character decision points. What do you mean? The dialogue of your V on the part with alt is more sad for me. I'm I'm probably gonna replay that one as well. I don't think I'll do the Johnny one when I do my full replay, but I think I wanna see a few of the endings still. Yeah, the endings do play out very differently. You may well find one of them more satisfying. Yeah, I'll, I'll check back. It means I'm gonna delete the Cyberpunk channel on the Discord. It's gonna get deleted because I've now played the game and no longer care about spoilers. Hi, Dindel! Have a good rest of your workday! In the Witcher books, the female characters are definitely the most powerful ones, only Vilgefort surpassing them, but I notice they're often treated as objects by some other characters, especially males, but not exclusively. 
However, that kind of makes sense for the world it's set on. Overall, I've seen women uh, there as figures of extreme power and respect. Yeah, I, I personally really like how the Witcher characters are written in general. Because I feel like, we've, we've talked about this before, but the, the fact that every character sucks. <laughs> oh no, the cat's already gone. <laughs> when she comes back, I'll give her a candy. Because uh, it's it's true that the you know the female characters they have a lot uh, going on in a in a bad way, but and so, so do the male characters. I think for Siri it probably is the most apparent, but like those are late book spoilers, so I don't really want to talk about that. I think for Siri it was the most egregious for me. I definitely do have a few problems with how Siri came about her trauma, shall we say? I don't I don't like a lot about the Siri arc. I don't know, maybe I'll make a video about that at one point. I think that the games actually weirdly did a lot to remedy that, though. though. Not that that makes it easier to stomach the books, but, you know. Parts of the game where the NPC goes, I will not dump lore on you and give my entire backstory in three parts of this one cutscene. <laughs> yeah. Just when I was reading the first two books, the way women were talked about, it was either like they were objects or being used for sex. At least that's how it was coming across to me. Okay. I'm trying to think back on the first two books and how they... I guess they already had the... They already definitely had the Kalanta thing going on. With how they deal, dealt with women in Sintra. I can definitely see that. I can definitely see that. I think it's also partially because Geralt is very... Blasé about sleeping with people as well. And obviously all the kings kind of suck. But that's kind of... Why I really like Meeve as well. But she's not until later. You won't see her until much later. <laughs> Branson. I turned her six, uh, six seasons and a movie. <laughs> oh god. The AI from PL may no longer exist, but there are suggestions that Blue Eyes is a proxy being controlled remotely. See, th that's the fact that his that he's literally called Blue Eyes made me think that as well, Duck. It made me consider that because of the way... Uh, blue, eye, blue eyes usually denote that they are um, they are using technology for it, like they're activating technology. I actually like the could just end it ending quite a lot in a way it makes the most sense. The one I have right now, or or the the one where she just takes a gun. Let's all hope the live action Cyberpunk show doesn't start. They're making a live action one. Are they actually? I find myself preferring linear games more these days. I am very much the same. I'm very much the same. It's also why. I technically have Zelda on my list. I have Tears of the Kingdom on my list. But I don't think I will be playing them for a while. Just because it's an open world game. I don't want to play open world for a little bit. So there's a... I, I have Alan Wake 2 on my list still. We're going to play Plague Tale Requiem. Um, that will be a good one as well. Well, not Death Stranding. Definitely not that one. Maybe Final Fantasy The Zodiac Age. Alone in the Dark is on there now. Frostpunk 2. A little bit of Frostpunk. I prefer to play games and stories in parts. Yeah, it makes sense. It makes sense. Have a good lurk, Suspicious. I did, Vivi. I did finish it. Series arc after the tower was a bit trauma the journey. Yeah, her entire point at that... Again, I'm not going to spoil it because Danny hasn't read it yet. Uh, but I don't... Danny, I will say this right now. Uh, a lot of the Siri arc, after a certain point, is very graphically uncomfortable, I want to say. There are parts of the books that unless I was writing a, a, a video specifically about a certain thing that was included there, I would skip. And if you've read the books, you probably already know what parts I skipped. Because they were not... They were just... They were torture porn. It's its all I can say about it. They are torture porn. And there's people who come in... When somebody tells you that Leo Bonhart is their favorite character, red flag. And, and with Leo Bonhart, I can honestly say... It is not even a case of, oh, but you can just appreciate how the character was written. No, because I do not think that Leo Bonhart was well written either. I think he was terribly written. I think he was incredibly one-dimensional and he was literally just there to fulfill the role of torturer. 
I'm just gonna say it there. Just, I just got it. I got it. Sorry. If he's your favorite character, reconsider. I love those open world games. It just takes so much. Yeah, it takes a lot of attention, of my attention span, genuinely. The gun one, it does have some harrowing voicemails afterwards though. Oh, cause they, I guess they find your body. Hanago's proxy at the motel does support the control theory, right? Yeah, like they just have a doll, basically. Remember when everything got a cartoon or an anime OVA series? Now everything's becoming live action. I'm not here for it. One particular scene that stuck out to me that gave me the ick was that Geralt gets getting upset he wasn't offered a woman to sleep with at a place he was staying at. I don't remember that ever happening. Uh, okay, I guess that's just the first two books. I think it, it's okay if you tell me. Was it the Temple of Melitre? Because I think I, I know... I know why, oh, how you could read it that way. I can tell you what it actually means, though, if that helps. Have we finished the game? Do we even want to see the 2013 trailer lady? Yeah, um, did we, <laughs> did we miss her? Yeah, Alone in the Dark I put on the list as well. Playing Control at the moment. I loved Control. Oh, RIP DJ, yeah, the links are uh, sub only. Sub and, sub and up, I guess. Got people that worked on Mr. Robot, so I have high expectations given how good that show was at the portraying the realities of hacking. I have not watched Mr. Robot either, but I am interested. But I am also definitely very, very tired of everything getting a, a live action. I'm a little tired. <laughs> Who the fuck likes him? Oh, you'd be surprised how often people would come in and say that they love Leo Bonhart. What do you think of V as a character compared to something like Commander Shepard or even Geralt? I feel like no matter what, V already kind of does have a little bit of personality of their own. But I do think that they were more blank slate than Geralt. Less so than Shepard. Shepard is probably the most blank slate you get as a, as a main character. But I really like the voice actor for V. I love the voice actor for V. Uh, I think it was a good decision to go first person. Because I remember when it was still in development and everyone was talking about how you were not going to get third person and how bad it was and they weren't going to play the game. And I, I think it's better that they did first person. I can also see that a few people said they were getting a little bit of nausea playing, which I understand. I, I think in that case, definitely play it less. Play it, play it in doses. Don't don't level your shinobi too high. Uh, but I, I, I don't know that I can say I like V because I'm playing as V, so it depends on how V is being played. But I like the the idea of V. I think V's V's entire arc from being this bright-eyed merc wanting to make it big in Night City, and then by the end, like almost immediately getting slapped down, but by the end being so incredibly disillusioned. I like that arc. And obviously it's up to you on how you play that arc, how you play her or him. But uh, I did, uh, yeah. I care about my character. I think that's important. I care about my character. What about playing the next Yakuza game on the list? Yakuza has open worlds. I consider Yakuza open worlds. I don't know if everyone does, but I do. Maybe I'm wrong about what Johnny, Fr Johnny friendship affects. Honestly, there's so much conflicting info. Because there's so many options, right? I don't remember exactly where it was, but I know it was due to the fact he was a witcher or a mutant. Oh, okay. I think that might have just been him being... Okay. I think you might have noticed already, Danny. Uh, Geralt is a very depressed character in the books. And sometimes he's just depressed about the fact that he's a witcher, that he's a mutant. And he will talk about it in his head. The same people who go on about how Grant Griffith or Tannis are. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think there's also definitely a difference between appreciating. Again, I say I, I just said I do not believe Leo and Bonhart is well written, but there is a difference between liking a character because they're, they're well written and they're interesting to watch and are interesting to see where they're going. But uh, my problem with characters like like Thanos, I can even kind of understand that you think he's an interesting character, but Leo Bonhart is genuinely not an interesting character. I will tell you right now what Leo Bonhart is. Leo Bonhart is a man who likes to torture women. That's it. That's all he has. There is literally nothing else about this character. He will remain the same person from start to finish. There is zero change. 
That's why he's just a bad character. Not just because like he's a bad man. Also, my camera is like, you're talking about Leo Bonhart? I don't want it. <laughs> Visa is semi-blank slate. Technically, there's nothing there, but the references the character makes, the way they talk, and the people they associate with give them a semblance of personality. Yeah, exactly. I agree. There's a lot of old anime that needs to be remade or rescued from the old VHS, VHS and Laserdisc scene. There's a lot of hidden gems in anime that would do well in modern age. There's also a few that I think people definitely look through rose-colored glasses for. Uh, that are that are also they did not age well at all. But yeah, a few definitely. People who like the main character from American Psycho and not getting the point of the movie. But they also tell them themselves, right? And the way they talk about them is is how they tell them on themselves. I like male V's voice acting way more than male Shep. I do actually like the male Shep voice actor. But I think I also like I like male Shep because I like the that the guy who voices male Shep has a sense of humor. <laughs> I'm still torn on the first person or third person. I prefer first person in a more linear game, but third in open world. Not really a fan of just going through an open world game and just staring at them. New Vegas is an exception. Fair enough. I think for a game like this as well, I think logistically it wouldn't make sense. I will say that sometimes I wondered what the point was of having a lot of really cool outfits outside of looking at yourself in the in the menu and taking screenshots because you don't really see V, right? You have all these outfit changes and you can create a character for five million years and then you just don't see them very much. I would have liked more opportunities to see them, I think in a cutscene maybe, but I also understand that uh, having to deal with animating all of that with integrating that in a way that it also doesn't bug. I understand that that might just be a waste of resources. I did, Otter! We're finally done! Also, an ad is gonna play in like three minutes. I will not pause. I will not take a break. I apologize. So if you do not have a sub or Prime or Turbo or whatever, uh, I'm afraid you will see ads. There's nothing I can do about that now. Switching three, uh, third first person is a lot to deal with on a technical level. Expecting bo both paints them as Bethesda players in my book. Yeah, no, I agree completely. It means collision detection has to match up and make sense in two different points of views. And with how much there's already in the game. Yeah, I agree completely, Grulian. I agree completely. Yakuza has open world, but I also consider it a very big distract distraction because of all the mini games and sub stories. 100%. But I think that's also, I need something that's a little bit more straight to the point. Uh, I might even, I might even put like an indie or something, something from my Friday list on my main game list for a little bit. Welcome back, Core. Did I miss somebody coming in again? Oh, the Raven, I didn't even say hello. I'm so sorry. Hello. Waka. <laughs> See, Waka has a change though. You can still not like Waka by the end of the game. I'm not going to talk about it too much, Otter, because what, you're flying through the game. You are absolutely flying through the game. Gods, and I, I cannot wait to hear your thoughts on the whole game. But Waka has progression, you know? I like the Joker from the Dark Knight, Chaos Incarnate. I don't like him as a person. Yeah, because he's interesting, right? And he also does not, he doesn't outstay his welcome. And his reasoning isn't just, yeah, well, I'll say no more, say no more. I don't want to spoil anything for Danny, but yeah. I feel like I should warn you about it. Much character, yes. Love a well-written villain. Leo is not that. Yeah, Bonnard is a right bastard. It's true. <laughs> Very true. You know what we need? More animated remakes. More animated everything. I love animated everything. I love animation. I am a big animation fan. You mean like Ranma 1, 2? Oh my god, don't get me started. Don't get me started how on how badly Ranma half has aged. Holy shit! The entire premise of Ranma Half is, haha, do you see this child? The child is turning into a little girl and now everyone wants to molest her. Padam! Enjoy it! It was a lot. Mark Mir, is that his name? Hi, Super Serious. <laughs> Come hello. Stories and character stories need to change and evolve in order to be interesting and provide the many faces of set character giving pro perspective to the viewer yeah exactly if everything stays the same constantly then and ranma had the same had the same problem actually because I, I think i said this on stream before but uh i so i watched 
three seasons of Ran Ma Half because I was like, maybe, maybe it'll change. It did not. And then, so I watched those three and I said, okay, I gotta know if any of the characters at the very least changed by the end of the show. So I watched the end of the show. Guess what? Nothing changed. They were all still the same. Everything was still incredibly the same. <laughs> Because I know what I will do in the near future, binge with Ranma half. Enjoy that. Photo made mode is the reason for outfits in Cyberpunk, but she didn't do much. I don't know that I uh, that the photo mode is that good, but I'll probably play around with it later to see. Saw so Riding Bean on YouTube last night, and now I want to rewatch Gunsmith Cat. Gunsmith Cats? Riding Bean? That's. Uh, I don't think I know any of those. <laughs> Not a Final Fantasy game. I do have an. I have a Zodiac Age on my list. I have no. Oh, Oxenfree maybe. See, I have. Let's see. So I have twenty-four games on my main game list, but a, a good number of them are open worlds. And then my Friday list. I currently have forty-four games. There's a lot, a lot of games there. Oxenfree is on there too. Have a nice death is on there. Cocoon, Hi-Fi Rush, uh, Demon Souls is also on there. I probably will move that one to the main, main list instead. Oh, I don't know why this one's on there. That one's on the other one too. Amnesia: The Bunker is still on there. The Thaumaturge, Venba, Storyteller. There's a few smaller games. A few little, few, a few. Oh God, words. Little indies. I'm in America currently. There are ads on everything that has a stream. I know. Oh my God. Ice. There's so many ads. There's so many ads. America is ridiculous with that. I am? I feel like I'm very slow. No, you're going really fast. You actually are. I'm sorry, what? Yes. <laughs> I said what I said. Yeah, I, 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 so I watched three seasons. Uh, his dad changes into a panda. And Ranma is a boy who changes into a girl if there's cold water in his face. And then everyone wants to sleep with him. I mean, they don't say it, but they do. There's a few moments where he, where he in girl form gets kissed and he's like, I don't want this, but uh, you know, there, she's a little girl, so it's fine. Animation lets you be creative to let your to your heart's content, even with all the hard work that goes into it. Animators in the anime industry really are overworked. They are. They really are. And there's a lot of expectations, weirdly. The other girl being Sham Shamplu. Shamplu. Yeah. The girl Ranma has to marry well, so so technically I guess he was he has to marry more than one person. Because Shamplu is because of because he defeated her. And uh the other girl I actually forget her name. Uh but the the one that he actually came over to marry. <laughs> that one. And the other guy turns into a pig and bathes the girl. And then the other girl's whore. Oh, yep, yep. Yeah, the other guy turns into a little pig and sleeps with the girl that Ranma was supposed to marry in the first place. <laughs> yeah, I Listen. Akane, that's her name. That's her name. See, but Ranma doesn't love Akane. That's like the weird thing. That's, there's like this. So Ranma one half is, is uh, the premise is a will they, won't they, right? But it is literally just like every season, zero progress. And then at the end, the final episode of, of Ranma is just like admitting that they have feelings, but also they don't do anything about it and they go back to the status quo anyway. <laughs> For my mini campaign, I'm making Understandable Village who are also queer. Love a good queer villain. Hi-Fi Rush is now on PlayStation 5 since last month. I only found it today. I really want to play Hi-Fi Rush. I've heard very good things about them. Oxenfree, the first one is so good. I haven't gotten a chance to play two yet. I really like the first Oxenfree, uh, Oxenfree, but I also haven't played two yet. So I want to stream that one. I also streamed the first Oxenfree. Need to make a request for some game at some point. Yeah, my current request is Deus Ex from Septic. We're playing that on Friday. I don't know if we're going to play something else tomorrow. Thank you for playing. You're so welcome. There's still so much to see and do. Actually, that's not true. <laughs> I've already done every gig, and I've done every side quest, and I have every single uh, fast travel point. I have everything. 
As you say, I see where Twitch is coming from now. Wow. Wow. The credits are like 30 plus minutes. It's okay. I wanted to talk anyway. Storyteller is a good short Friday game, but you might want to add something else to reach the four hour stream mark. Please, I can just talk. I can talk for days. For days. My eyes have fun not watching ads. I hope. Love you, buddy. Someone who doesn't watch anime, this conversation about Rama is so weird. It's, the thing is, it, most anime have something going on where you're like, ooh, do I wanna... Do I wanna grit my teeth and bear it because the rest of the show is good? Or... You know, and there's a few that don't have anything, but they are very rare. I'm just gonna, like, cause, okay. So I am a big fan of Dragon Ball. The way Dragon Ball treats women, <laughs> whoo! Like, I, I actually read the manga, the Dragon Ball manga at one point, and it's, there's Bulma, who is literally a child. Uh, they meet Master Roshi, and Master Roshi is like, show me your tits. <laughs> like, it's a, it's a child, all right? Like, anyway, anime, am I right? I played a tabletop game with some old friends, plus some new ones a few years back. And the GM used some of our old PCs as significant NPCs and extrapolated from some of the stuff we had done. My returning character was called Leo Hart, and I had to repeatedly explain that the name was not a Leo Bonhart reference and was picked more than a decade before I encountered the Witcher series. Oh no! Oh, that's so unfortunate. Ganma is actually every shonen anime protagonist. Whenever there is a female character that shows slight interest, he's like, a girl? Ew! Yeah. But I think also in the past, and I don't know if I just did not watch the correct anime at the time, but I feel like in the past there were a lot more, I want to say villain of the week anime than there are now. There's the most anime that are made now have a through line. They have this, this the main story that they're progressing through. Whereas in the past, you know, we had we were watching Sailor Moon. That's very villain of the week. They still have a through line, but it's mostly villain of the week. And Ranma is definitely villain of the week. Um, Dragon Ball, not really, but like a little bit. Like there, a lot of it was just here's here's today's problem. We solve it, and then we have a new one tomorrow. But I I don't even know if that's just an anime thing because I feel like everything kind of had that. Charmed had that too. Charmed had villains of the week. Scooby Doo. <laughs> Buffy, honestly, where like it was, there was some progression, but it wasn't, it wasn't like a, the the big thing, the big attraction was just the monster of the week, which I do like in, in a way it makes sense because then you can just come in whenever you want. How much old anime don't hold up nowadays? Most of them, most of them, honestly, it's exactly the reason I don't watch anime. See, I do enjoy anime. I do enjoy anime, but uh, in, in small doses. They were written so you could drop in any time in, in the season. Yeah, exactly. Kamikaze Kaito Jin? Jin? Kamikaze... Kami... Ka, Kamikaze Kaito... Phantom Thief Jin! I don't think I've ever seen that one. Oh yeah, it's like that. It's like the peak old anime style. The old, like, I'm so surprised with how much anime style evolved. From because in the past everyone had like the huge eyes, like the massive eyes and the very thin front, uh, like hair. You know what I mean? They all had a very similar style, and now no one uses that style anymore. No one at all. Final of the week is one of the most common templates for episodic storytelling. Yeah, absolutely. I just feel like I feel like it's it's something that doesn't really happen that much anymore. I feel like most of the shows that I watch now or hear about. They are all just a really long movie, technically, right? Where you're just trying to get one big story out. Monster of the Week can be fun, but it can't last forever. Yeah, it has to. It, there has to be some progression somewhere at some point. Unless you're Marvel, then jumping in at any film or TV show will make zero sense unless it's Moon Knight. Yeah, right now I feel that way. But that's also why I feel like if I want to start something, I can't just kind of jump into it a little bit. I have to watch everything to really get the full experience. In German, it was uh, Jean die Kamikaze die Bin. <laughs> yeah. Oh God, I guess, yeah, I guess the anime is also dubbed over in German. 
Anyone heard of the new Black Butler OVA coming out? I see Black Butler everywhere all of a sudden. That it's like a really... I, I've been spoiled for Black Butler for some things. Probably I will never remember, but... I heard that it's really good. I forgot that this one existed. We didn't have that much anime on TV when I was younger. I think we had... So we had Pokemon. We had... Dragon Ball Z. We had Metabots. We had Digimon. Super Pig. <laughs> we had Super Pig as well. I actually really liked Super Pig was like Sailor Moon kind of, but oh, and also, oh god, Shinzo. I feel like I bring this one up a lot, and I feel like I'm literally the only person who has ever watched this anime. Oh god, no. <laughs> no. Now I'm writing down Shinzo, and all I get is My Hero Academia. Academia. That's not the one I mean. Yeah, Shinzo! Wait, I'm gonna type it out. That. That anime? I swear I am the only person who watched that anime. <laughs> I actually really enjoyed it. But it was literally just an anime version of Journey to the West. Maybe that's why I, I also really like Journey to the West, but it's basically just that. I kind of want to watch that show again, just to, just to finish it. The Prime Minister? Yes, the anime about the Prime Minister. Older animes were dubbed better than the newer ones, or at least it, as kids it wasn't too obvious. Yeah, I think I even, Pokemon was also dubbed into Dutch, actually, now that you mention it. High production value, serial storytelling really became the rule around the TV renaissance. Most people agree that it started around the time Lost debuted. Yeah, because Lost did really well, right? Oh my god, we were playing Cyberpunk and now we're talking about completely different. Listen. We haven't derailed the chats uh, very much recently, so it's okay. The OVA films are canon to the manga. The first two seasons are just their own thing. Oh! It's not even related. Oh, okay. Hi, Anna Thanks. I'm sorry. Though no one in Germany apparently knew rice balls, and every time rice balls were shown, German dubs called them sandwiches. I think in uh, in English they call them jelly donuts, right? First donuts, now sandwiches. <laughs> Anyone ever watch Gangutsuo? Gangutsuo. Wait, did I write that correctly? No. Definitely not. Oh my god. Is it- do you mean Gankutsuo? With like a K, Otter? Yeah, okay. I just want you to know, Otter. Listen, I feel like you can appreciate this. But I- I googled your name. And I got Gankutsuo, the Count of Monte Cristo. But then I was like, hmm. I don't, that's not what Otter means, so I will I will press the search instead for Gangutsuo anime. And I need you to know that the only things that showed up were two top, <laughs> top links called Gangutsuo anime porn at younghentai.net. The second link being multivore free anime porn on Pro Hentai. And then the bottom link being Animal Crossing New Horizons free manga pussy fuck on hentai for all. And I want you to know you did that to me. <laughs> With your typo. <laughs> no one in Germany knew the rice balls? Oh yeah. No, I don't actually know what you call them in Dutch. Maybe we also called them brood? I have no idea. Which ending did you end up doing? I'm not going to tell you because Noob just entered the chat. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. I, I have a thought. <laughs> Need to watch a good modern anime that isn't an isekai, but I like an isekai. Some English dubs back then were rough as hell or insert pop culture American jokes. A lot of stuff also got taken out and filtered. No, don't leave, noob. You don't have to. We're done. <laughs> An anime is actually really good. The, the hentai ones I just read out? Or... <laughs> Oh, Otter. Can't believe you've done this. Otter had a Freudian slip. Otter was like, who oh, no. The other one. <laughs> Lovely, hello. 
<laughs> that's there forever now. You had to hear me say that. I left for like three seconds. What the hell, Otter? <laughs> Otter. I didn't think you were that sort of film, Otter. Didn't you? Have you been to his stream? Did you know Otter has a new video out? Did you know? Did you know Foe does too? Did you know there's new videos for two people, but not me? The way this is one time I didn't mean it to be cursed. For once, Robin's Killer and High School Girl were really good. Only on Netflix though. I usually do just like, uh, you know, yo ho fiddle dee doo. It's on the list eventually. Yeah. Still waiting on a new season of The Way of the House Husband. I think I want to read that as a manga. I heard that the manga is uh, a little bit better looking. You also have a new video out. In my mind, I actually have already worked. I've recorded the Baldur's Gate video ages ago. Ages ago. But I'm trying not like, okay, okay. Do you want to hear something very interesting? <laughs> Burnout caused hair loss for me. I'm not kidding. I am not kidding. I stopped working on videos and now my hair is fine like no joke I, I went to the doctor for this i was like listen i don't know what the fuck is going on she's like yeah well i don't know try iron pills or something peace i stopped working on videos i'm fine i'm fine i don't even like i did not realize how much of an effect like the, the stress being up here had on my body, like physically on my body. I was like, oh yeah, okay, of course I'm tired. Of course, like I'm, I have to work really, really long, but whatever. But this, anyway, my hair is back. It's great. Isn't that great, Arwen? Do you want the candy? Tindall redeemed the candy for you earlier. Yes, that's correct. She's here again. Uh, but I, I am still working on videos. It's just uh, for, so I'm gonna go a little bit hard on the cyberpunk compilation. <laughs> there you go because i do want to i want to have the cyberpunk compilation the first part at least out on this sunday uh and i think once i'm done compiling cyberpunk i'm gonna actually edit the Baldur's gate 3 one which i feel like okay i have this weird dread in my head right i don't know if this is valid or not but i took so at, the, at that point it'll be like what seven months since i've uploaded a new video more maybe and i have this weird dread in my head not dredge, but dread. That when I upload a video, because the, the Baldur's Gate 3 video is not like super deep or super long or super in depth or whatever. It's just something I wanted to talk about. And in my head, I'm like, I can't upload anything that isn't a literal magnum opus because I've been gone so long. Does that make sense? I'm like, if I upload anything that isn't the best thing ever, people were like, this is why you were gone that long. But like, no, I was gone this long because I literally just had to take a break. I was not working on anything. But in my head, it has to be the best thing ever. It does make sense. I feel that, yeah. I, I, I have been making compilations, obviously. I have been. So I have been working on stuff and I've obviously been streaming. But in the back of my head, I'm like, okay, but this is my main channel. Invent butter again? Oh no, a little bit of guilt-motivated guilt perfectionism, yeah, a little bit. Makes sense to me, yeah. That was me with my Sable video, to be honest. Turns out it was my magnum opus, but yeah. I loved your Sable video. I'm not sure that's a good thing. It's not, it's definitely not. I do have a therapist now again, um, but yeah, we'll see. I'm gonna upload it anyway. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna upload it because I will be against uploading it. I will not want to upload it, but I think I'm going to because I, yeah, I'm gonna tell my brain to go fuck itself. I want to uh, be able to upload against my wishes because my brain is usually so dumb about it. It's like, okay, well, uh, I can't make this video about this thing because that is that uh, someone already did that at one point, <laughs> one day. They've already done that somewhere, so now I can't. My local Forbidden Planet had most of the way of the house husband manga except the first volume. Yeah, I heard that they did the anime in the same style, but it, it doesn't really work. Yeah, stress. Just wear a wig. Listen. 
I want to actually watch Spy Family at one point, Danny. One day, one day. I'm so kidding. Are you? Then will you wear wigs? Otto. Stress is terrible. Stress and depression. And depression. Everything. I well, I skip. Okay. I don't know if that's the TMI, but I guess for for all the all the people that also have periods in the chat. I just feel like I should tell this because most people don't know this. You can skip every single one of your periods. You don't have to have them. And you're, you will be fine. In fact, you will be better because... Because. I don't have them anymore. I skip them. All of them. Like, every so often, I'll be like, okay, well, maybe. Uh, but I just I skip. I also feel better. <laughs> Pose balder anyway, okay. Tell your brain to go fuck itself, yeah. I'll be your muse, I'll lay down naked and sensual and whisper you got this from across the room. Noob, now that just makes me think of your break screen. The little the little guy with who's lying on the floor floor who's drawing you. That guy, is is that what you're gonna look like? Yeah. Hagada's thoughts, yeah. Upload it with something deliberately imperfect. Okay, I don't know that I can do that. I hope you'll eventually get to the point where someone else can edit, publish uh, stuff like that so you can let go of it. I, that's so hard for me to do because I, I, oh, I'm a control freak about my videos. I really am. Faith control. You can, Otter. You can. <laughs> I believe in you. It is a life hack. It, I genuinely thought you, <laughs> you can skip them. It saves so much time. It does, though. Because you don't have to be in pain or whatever. You don't have to deal with it. Hell yeah, we're skipping periods. Just always make sure to take the occasional pregnant and in and see test. Um, and and also, yeah, like sometimes. Okay, I won't go too deep into it, but if you you know, look into it if you're interested. There's a few things where you're like, okay, now I should take a week off. But usually, skip it. Hiring an editor, otter. See otter. If I could hire an editor, I would. I would. It's just great because I live in Texas. <gasps> I did a grill so I can't get pregnant. Life hack. Then I'll disappoint my editor. That's true. Oh God. <laughs> just to be safe, <laughs> Feels so weird about my mega compilation of Shadowheart Lazel enemies to lovers. This will be the only video on a new channel. Who cares? If that's what you want to do, Danny, it's gonna look great. It's gonna look amazing. And it's it's something you want to make. That's what's important. Okay, Gulo. All right. A man goes to a funeral. He walks up to the window and asks if he could say a word. The widow thanks him, saying, "That would be very nice." The man clears his throat and says, A portion. The widow replies with a single tear falling from her eye. Thank you. That means a lot. <laughs> See? Listen! Gulo, I know you have made the widow jokes before. With a different word. Every single time. Gulo! I hate you here. Oh. I'm dating two men. Does this mean I'm pregnant? Yes, it does. Right now, in fact. Procreation? Not even once. I'm single. Incredible life hack. <laughs> Who, me? You. You. I remember. You think I forget? I remember. Have you seen the pun I posted in the pun channel? Yeah, and I giggled a little bit. If I didn't want to tell you that, because then you would know. But now you know anyway. Couldn't have been me, Kulo. Are you lying to me? Are you lying to me right now? You better not be lying to me right now. Yo, oh my god, we actually got to the bottom of the chat? They have to post in here as well. Just one more gig. I want to see the special reward before we end. It's very important. Yo, basically a four hour stream. I thought we were gonna overtime. I didn't think that I was literally at the final quest. Oh, look, that looks like I'm a criminal because there's like a... <laughs> I moved the thing. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. <laughs> Little criminal following bar. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do,
Let me turn the desktop up a little bit more. So I can hear all my loud alerts. Okay, it's not that loud. Hey, look at me, not dead. Oh, and I wear my good outfit again. Hey, Macarena. Available at, oh, the Militech Berserk. It's a different one, but also the same. See, I, the invulnerable to damage? It, it does not, it doesn't, I don't care about that. Why would I want to spend 15 more points for that? It doesn't, it's, there's no point. The Judgment Tarot card. Acts a key to a room at the Abonimini Kemini. And the manama -na -ma -na. Available in your backpack. The Prejudice, Pride and Prejudice. A monument to pistols everywhere. One of the best rifles to ever grace the planet. But I use knives. I cannot use any of these things. Does that mean I actually have... Oh yeah, so then it just stays here. You can just do it again if you want. Wait, do I have every single tarot card? Oh, I'm missing one. <laughs> okay, I won't, I won't look at it because Noob is in the chat. I'm just gonna stare at the floor. I guess those are, those are nice. They are nice. For people who are not me. <laughs> is it tarot for each ending? Oh, okay. I will literally run away. Don't you dare. You get back here right now. Am I supposed to be immaculate? We had a frog yesterday. It is really, really, really rare right now. It is actually really rare. If you're gonna idle, at least put us in photo mode. But spoilers. What about the- Radio Wechselstrom. Wechselstrom. A German radio? Wow. Can I make her do something? I threw a grenade. <laughs> Does that help? <laughs> Listen. <laughs> oh, I'm a goose. All right, kids. This is the last time we will be in Night City. Are you sad? Are you a little sad? I feel a little sad. But also, I did I did finish the game. Congrats on finishing Cyberpunk. Thank you. Not really. <laughs> he said, fuck Cyberpunk. <laughs> You're welcome for streaming, Duck. You're welcome for streaming, Lonious. Thank you, Shadow. I'm also a little sad at the end of a long play game. Same. It's like you're leaving. I don't know. It's like leaving after a vacation. Like you're going somewhere on vacation and then you have to leave and go home. It feels like that. Isn't that right, Arwen? Exactly. Thank you, Ronnie. You're welcome for stream, Danny, Shadow, Jeff, Tindell, Skull, Patch. <laughs> same with books? Same with books. How many stream mode hours did it take? Ah, uh, <laughs> good question. Okay, I know we had a few streams where we literally just sat and talked. Uh, I cannot give you an, a fully accurate number. I can tell you that this will be stream number 33 and I overtime for some of them. 33 streams at four hours ish. I did a little bit of back work as well, like a little bit of work um, off stream as well. 167 and a half play hours right here. Ah, you know what? I have a question, <laughs> forgot. Why? We saved the day. We've extincted the cyber antagonist. We're robbing a casino. Well, apparently I did become a legend of the afterlife. So I think that confirms I, uh, that I, uh, we died. Because that's the achievement I got. So don't worry, noob. There are many, many different endings. This is but one. 33 is a pretentious number. I think so too. Out of spites. <laughs> Listen. All right. Am I raiding anybody today? Noob, go live. <laughs> I don't think I am. Cause I no, Matt is actually live. I am. You don't have to go live, Noob. But you can. But I'm gonna raid Noob. I'm gonna. I'm gonna raid Noob. I'm gonna raid. I'm gonna raid Matt. 
You better not be ending right now, Matt. I swear to God. Okay, you're not. Okay, I had to make sure. Uh, nope. Shh, Matt. I caught the end of emergency raids! I know! Incredible. Baby, you like that? He understands. We're gonna hang out with Matt. He is, because speaking of D&D stuff, tabletop anything, he does a lot of that. And I will see you tomorrow with, I don't know yet. I'm gonna, I'm gonna steal this from Noob. I'm gonna make a poll in the Discord and you can vote with emotes. Because, uh, because. Uh, but we are gonna play Plague Tale next for this one. You can vote on what we're doing after that. It's not a very long game, so don't worry. There's a Discord, you bet. You have to link your Twitch to the, to the Discord and we'll automatically invite you. You're welcome, free stream. Bye, Nyan Nyan. Bye, noob. See you soon. <laughs> okay, I'll see you tomorrow, everyone. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you for ending Cyberpunk with me. It was a fantastic game. I had a really good time and I will probably play it again sometime. Bye, Lander. Bye, Patrick. Bye, Otter. Bye, Shadow. Until next time. Bye, Faith.